Well, well, etc. Look at this. This is a fine kettle of fish that we've got brewing here. I decided to take the plunge into starting my own server. Library and Long Plays, I've called it. Not very original, it's the name of this channel. Basically. PvE with Purge, much plugins. Cut off from this description, it says chill vibes. Mmm. Zero to 50, vanilla. We're gonna go over a lot of things here, needless to say. But uh, I figured I would uh, start it up while we chat. Um, I'm gonna have to do, because uh, wipe was yesterday, and <clears throat> unfortunately, uh, and I know I've mentioned this in other videos, the uh, one day a week that I am in the office is Thursday. So I can't, uh, you know, do any testing or stuff like that because, you know, I'm in the office. So uh, we're going to have to do some testing. One thing I know needs to be set up. Uh, and then we're going to have a, you know, a sort of default as I've been doing a uh, long wipe where I spend the day uh, at least getting the bones down of a good base. And then we sort of uh, go from there. And then uh, I, I, at least I've done the last couple of times, uh, that would be the first portion of the episode, the lion's share, probably. Uh, and then we end with a, a base tour. So like at the end of the month, <laughs> you see all the, the stuff I have done, which is interesting, ideally. Okay, so uh, yeah, let me run down uh, some of the stuff that I got going on on this server. Uh, to description, that'll probably help. Uh, a PV server with a purge four days before wipe and BP's wiping every other month. Um, I think I might change that to every month. Uh, I, I'm still, you know, this is month number one, so I'm still in the testing phases very much. Uh, mostly quality of life type plugins, but I suggest you read the plugin info tabs to take full advantage of what the server has to offer. This is just the server description. Things like admin shop, which is what we have to set up this morning. Cause uh, I did set it up, <clears throat> but apparently, uh, it gets wiped, you know, on force wipe. So there's that, uh, it shouldn't take too, too long. I've got all the, the commands and prices and stuff written down so uh i've got a two-line backpack which is protected which i like uh basically if i didn't say so which i don't think i did i've played on a lot of rust servers and a lot of them have things i very much like but none of them have had exactly what i'm looking for so i figured in order to accomplish that goal of finding a server that has everything i want i'm just gonna have to make it myself uh i'm using pine hosting which um I will say on the note of hosting, it's good. However, I was not prepared for the amount of coding I would have to do, which I am not a coder by any means. Like I know a little bit and I have, you know, fiddled my way, fuddled, fiddled. I fiddle fuddled my way through and uh, got things set up pretty good. But <clears throat> my, my, my coding knowledge is existent but by no means large. So adding plugins is easy. Uh, adding these plugins I'm about to sort of run down is easy, uh, but getting them uh, sort of set up in the way that you want them set up and activating them in certain ways, that is where the coding comes in. So keep that in mind. If you're afraid of coding, which <laughs> I am, uh, you, you might want to reconsider or have someone help you, I guess. Okay. So yeah, protected backpack, meaning when you die, you lose everything except for what's in these two lines of your protected backpack, which I like because it sort of adds like a little strategy. I feel like, Oh, uh, in this admin shop, I should mention, I'm going to have a test generator. And uh, one of the plugins I have is deployable vehicles, which is pretty cool. So like you like throw out a mini, throw out a, a sedan, things, things of that nature. So you could like keep them in your inventory. Either. Uh, I think I just added the ability to pick them up. I don't know if I, I'll have to test that. A lot of testing. This is sort of a test month for myself. I'm going to play on it as if it was just a normal server. 
Um, okay, I see we're here. Okay, so, uh-oh, wolves. Yeah, I added a bunch of wolves around all monuments. Okay, so I think what I need to do, we're going to do admin stuff first. Did my levels, my levels did keep, did my bag keep? My bag did keep. Cool, okay. <laughs> Hopefully nobody finds this. Um, that was just a test to see, to make sure that when the map wipes. Uh, okay, so I'm going to be building... Where again? Wait, is this map? Oh, shoot. I think this map is a little different. Oh, it is, too. It's, like, almost the same as the map that I had planned on building on. But it's, like, slightly different. Oh, maybe it's because of this. Because of the update. Well, shit. Because I was going to build in E12, which is different now than it was. There was like a river here. Okay, so <clears throat> we're going to have to decide again where I'm going to build because things have changed. Somewhere up in this area. There was like a river here and yeah, things were different here. Interesting. So I used the same seed as I did in my test couple of weeks so things are almost the same but very slightly different maybe i'll i'm not really near anything yeah uh okay but first things first let's go to outpost uh i am gonna have to do some admin commands um okay so let me just see i've, I've got to to go back to my list commands uh, so there's one that lets me teleport. Oh, it was enabled. Okay, that makes sense. So basically I just, boop, and now I'm in outpost. Um, okay, so this is where my shop was. So, let me just eat these berries. Oh yeah, this is the starting kit. Why don't I just show you that? So... Yeah, I wanted to check what the difference was. Well, it's a little better. So this is like, you know, <clears throat> normally you start with a rock. Here you start with this, which is, you know, better than a rock, but not a huge difference. Better. You start with enough, um, enough berries to get your health to 100% and, you know, give you a little bit in the way of food and water. You start with uh, this, which is enough to, you know, get you through one night. So you spawn in at night, like a torch, but better. Then you can keep it after and fill it. I figured, you know, start with a backpack. That's pretty cool. Uh, this is on top of your protected backpack. Uh, mustache. Everyone starts with a mustache because that's dumb. Also guitar because I want music. I want music in my life. Uh, okay, you know what? Uh, I'm going to move. Okay, so. So now, how do I do this again? Oh, I thought I did save. Oh no, I did save. Okay, so spawn vending machine. So I need three vending machines. I just had them like one, two, three. Okay, so let's do one in the middle. It should just spawn right there. Uh, why did that not work? Moss. Huh? Huh now? Yeah, it sounds like it should stay after white, but TBD. It didn't stay after white. I'm a spawn. Yeah. Um, okay, so let me check my plugins. Now, I, I see the potential that this might be boring. <laughs> However, um, monument add ons. I wonder if only works a lot. Okay, let me copy it from here. So I just maybe. Um, 
I did have this. You switched to player mode. Yeah, so I'm going to turn that on when it's... Whoops. <laughs> I'm going to turn that on. You switch to admin mode. When, uh, when I'm playing, <clears throat> I can turn off all my admin stuff. Okay, well, this is somewhat worrisome. Maybe it's... I guess the potential exists that it's broken. Custom vending setup. No. Um. Monument add-ons. This is this one, right? M A spawn entity. For example, modular car left static. Hmm. Monument add-ons. Okay, let's look at the help page. Maybe people are like, hey, this is not working. Uh, compilation error since Rust updates. Wipe forth compile error. All right, fixed, fixed. <laughs> Did you install the latest version of the plugin? All right, so maybe if I update it. So that is called. This is exciting, right? Maybe I will not leave this in. Monument add-ons. Monument add-ons. Okay. So there is an error. I tried to reload it. While compiling monument add-ons, there's an argument given that corresponds to the required parameter Y offset of base navigator plane nav mesh float. Okay. Cool. God damn it. Uh, okay, so I think maybe... <clears throat> Let me check what these people are saying again. Um... Okay, I think I need to update it. How do I update it? Maybe I just install it or uninstall it. Okay, so new mints finder. Okay, so I'm gonna uninstall, reinstall. Let's see if that does it. Okay. Of a profile. Oh. Hey, that's cool. Okay, so I don't have to re-add them. Oh man, that's huge because that was actually I was gonna I admit that was gonna take a while. Um every time I add to that sign it just disappears, so I don't know why that is. Like I just put sh like right shop on it. Okay, but let me show you. Is that one? That's the sedan, I think. It, it should pop up in a second. So yeah, you can buy vehicles, and then they end up in your inventory, and then you just throw them. Here's all the boats. Tugboat, even. Pretty cool. Oh yeah, and your, your minis. Uh, attack helicopter would not work, and I'm not alone in that fact. And then I thought I would just sell some things. This, you know, just for hijinks sake, basically. Um, okay, so I, I'm going to try to make this little area nicer at some point, but you know, I just want to get the bones out. All right. So <clears throat> what's going on here? So here's the rule. This, my God, this took me a long time to set up in terms of coding because setting this up, if you had one comma in the wrong spot, it would revert to the defaults. And then like all your work 
it wouldn't necessarily be gone. Although in one case it was all gone and that really bugged me. Uh, so that took a while, needless to say. Um, okay. Yeah. Come cool collected. Don't be a dick. You know, your classic rules, which I should say, if you're watching this, please feel free to, uh, stop by and, uh, play if this sort of server seems like something that uh, might be up your alley it's not for everyone obviously those uh, pvp only folks probably not gonna enjoy it as much okay so discord i'm not gonna do a discord it's more work another thing to maintain <laughs> i did come up with this idea that if people want to report things that they would normally report to a server admin they have to go to <laughs> this youtube channel and the most recent video and put the uh the complaint or whatever there also one thing that does that i don't say here is if you're just going to come and like swear at me, uh, YouTube comments are filtered, uh, pretty good. <laughs> so that'll filter out any, uh, assholes, which is nice, which is nice. Cause I really don't want to do any admin stuff. I want to do my admin stuff, you know, once at the beginning of the wipe. And I guess at the end when I turn the bridge on and then that's it. Uh, okay. Yeah. And there's all that. Uh, here's the wipe schedule. So, um, April 4th, so this is where we are now. Wait, that's not right. Oh no, that is right. March, April, May, no. Is this right? <laughs> Anyways, that may or may not be right. <sighs> Commands, not too many. Info, what gets us here. I do want the remove tool, uh, especially because, uh, I've invited some newbies, uh, to the server. So, uh, that, that definitely helps in terms of when you inevitably put a wall down wrong and have to remove it, uh, home. So, uh, you can only have one, which means that vehicles still have a spot, uh, a place or more so because if you, I, I find if you have multiple homes, people just use them to move back and forth. Whereas I want vehicles to have a purpose, uh, kits. Yeah. Just the, the, the kit you get when you die, which I've already showed and give some, okay. So a min shop located at outpost buys gunpowder, sells test generator and deployable vehicles. Yeah. That's the one thing. So if you are at say bandit or you, you just click on, uh, well, I'll, I'll show you. It might be too close though. Um, I guess that's these. Yeah. So for the vehicles, you can't actually see what you're buying. It just shows us this. You have to actually come and it just says kayak. Not great. You actually have to come to see what you're, you're buying. It's okay. You know, better than nothing. And, uh, and this is an idea that I wanted to do. So there you go. All right. Oh yeah, uh, Z levels, you see I already have I've done like some minimal testing. I'm, I'm thinking maybe I should just start fresh actually. So, um, you know what, how do I do that? I think I'm going to do that right now. Oh, I, I, I really want to, for the purposes of this, uh, this month, uh, in this wipe sort of try everything from scratch. Uh, okay. So there is a way I think to like revert, at least I thought there was. <laughs> Can I change player levels? Okay. All right, maybe I can't, or if I can, it's not as easy as I thought. I thought it was just a simple command would let me do it. Stats, UI, night bonus. I do have a night bonus on. All right, all right, I, I guess I'll just leave it for now. Uh, how to disable, can I change player levels? 
right. Hmm. No, not an, not an easy command or an obvious one, a simple one. Okay, uh, yeah, so uh, bonuses to improve your use. So that's this right here. Uh, I've got some bonuses to all these things. And the more you do them, the larger your bonuses get. This is from like barely doing anything either. It goes up a, a nice chunk. So that's why uh, the loot is set to 1, 1x, one or vanilla, if you, if you want to call it that. Because this will improve it. Whereas the scrap is set to 2x. Okay, um, when you die, these do go down a little bit too. Okay, uh, and also they go up quicker at night. So if you're out and about doing stuff, they go up quicker. However, at night, zombies come out. Mm, they're not like super tough, like I made them half health. Um, but I do just like the idea of if you're out at night, you know, beware a little bit. Uh, backpack, yes, I mentioned that already. Loot, I mentioned already. Scrap is 2x. Uh, and I did buff the loot tables a little bit. A little bit. Mostly just your, uh, mostly just components. I, I buffed a, a, a wee bit. Uh, so yeah, half decay, bigger stacks, faster recycling, faster crate timer. It's a minute. Unburnable meat. Why not? Uh, no vehicle decay. Box sorter, which we'll see. Uh, infinite vendor stock. Yeah, that's nice. So that if you're selling poop, it should be a much quicker process. For example, uh, there's the plugins with commands. There's a foundation limit of 50, just so someone doesn't come on and start throwing down, you know, foundations over the whole map and grinding things up a bit. Uh, true PVE. Mm -hmm. Random respawn. Oh yeah, this is why I spawned in the snow because you can respawn anywhere which I thought was sort of interesting. Commands we've seen, plans. Yeah, there's definitely some, plugins are expensive, the non-free ones. So far, all I have is free ones. But uh, I wanna get things like water foundation would be fun, box stacking would, the box stacking I feel like should just be default, like in the actual base game. Uh, it just lets you, you know, stack boxes on each other. Uh, abandoned player bases I think would be cool. Now. Uh, less needed because nobody's on this server. <laughs> I don't know if there ever will be necessarily. This is more just for myself. Like, uh, as I said in the rules somewhere, uh, this is only not a private server because I thought others might like it. You know what I mean? Jelly bean. Um, yeah, map voting. Uh, I have this idea to have like a building or like a vending machine where if you buy this, it votes for this map. And if you buy this, it votes for this map, like something cheap, that, that sort of idea. Uh, yeah. Base tours of other people's other than myself, you know, I have some plans and, and things I want to do beautifying this. Um, okay. But let's, uh, do things to start our wipe. Uh, specifically, turn things off. <laughs> uh, okay, so I think I'll probably kill myself too. Okay, teleport disabled. There's one I just want to check to see if anyone is on here. I think my buddy Clark is, who you've seen in videos before. All right, so that's sleeping player Clark. Anyone else? <laughs> I don't think so. All right, well, we know where he is now. Well, we just said, we'll check out his base at some point. Um, all right, so let's turn that off. I don't know. Uh, I have to keep, stop. I have to keep checking my commands list. I think that stopped it. It did. Okay, so I'm still gonna, I think, oh, no, I'm not gonna go over there. Damn it, I had such a good build spot planned. It was like really cool. It was like a waterfall with like this like pillar. I was gonna like try to build from the pillar to the waterfall. Um, all right. Do we do islands? 
Yeah, that's tempting. And then I could build a bridge across. All right, all right. Um, ferry terminal. Oh, yeah, does the... Where does the... Uh, is it harbor? Do I have a harbor? Okay. So this is where the new harbor event takes place, I guess. Oh, man, maybe I should move up there. Got fishing village, mining up lice boat, that new harbor event. Yeah, what if I make my way up there? Because, uh, oh, there's another one. Does it stop on both? Probably. Oh, that I'm so far away from outpost, though. <laughs> I did kind of have a desert desert vibe this way I haven't lived in the desert in a while these two this is tempting here though and then I can drive down the coast uh, okay well why don't I check it out oh wow this is going to be a bit of a walk oh wait I was going to kill myself oh wait do I need to uh, yeah I guess I should so this is our fresh start. This is where the video would normally start. But, you know, I wanted to talk about new server stuff and get my admin stuff out of the way. All right. Where did I end up? Huh? Oh, I thought I turned that off. Eh. We'll be on a team soon anyways. Yeah, maybe I uh, run the road a bit on my way there. That makes as much sense of anything. <coughs> Damn, uh, it sucks because I had like a, a whole... Oh, shoot. It's going to be wolves. <laughs> I've just realized... I put wolves on all the monuments. Well, no, correction. Lighthouse, I put chickens. <laughs> I might, uh, my buddy said that they respawn pretty quick, so I might turn that down, though. Ooh. Oh, yeah, okay, so that's another uh, thing I, I added. So when you get a... When you get a uh, item that has skins available for it, like in a box or whatever, it's going to be with a random skin. Kind of cool. There's things I'm probably forgetting. Oh, no fall damage. Yeah. That, I find, just makes like getting around fun. If this is your first time watching one of these, I often say that uh, this is like my favorite part of Wipe. Just that initial day, finding a spot, getting set up, getting oh nice, uh, getting the bones down of a base. I don't know if I'm making the right choice, though, <laughs> in terms of uh, build spot. Because I did kind of want to be near outposts. Let's just look at our map again. Get in the back of this. Oh man, I should maybe cut across. If I'm out here at night, it's not going to be great. So I'd have a junkyard, which is great. Mining outpost is good. Is there... 
Yeah, there's a couple, uh, whatchamacallits. That I could take. As opposed to, then I'm far from Bandit, and I'm far from, super far from Outposts. If I ever have to go to Outposts. Uh, so my plan is also, potentially anyways, two bases. Um, one like on the land somewhere and then maybe like one out in the water a bit. <laughs> yeah, if I'm there, there's not really much around here though. All right, all right. I, I, I'm going to stick with this plan. Okay, so which way is it? I'm going to cut across. Cut across and hope that there's no wolves or bears. Oh, you know what I could do? Let's be smart about this. Oh, patrol helicopter. Oh, uh, that's something I added as well. The patrol helicopter um, should not target you unless you like shoot at it. Uh, that's one I haven't tested yet, though. So. <laughs> I mean, I'm fine now because I don't have, if you're unfamiliar, which I'll say this because I didn't actually know it until somewhat recently, um, when it comes to patrol helicopter, it won't target you, uh, unless you have, I believe it's three, three articles of clothing on, uh, and or a, uh, a weapon in your hotbar. Which, uh, I have verified that. Like, I, I've had a uh, weapon in my hotbar and, you know, full kit on. And then put those in my bag. And then it didn't target me. Um, that being said, I will say that... Uh... Oh, why didn't I use my axe, idiot? I will say that uh, if it's already targeted targeting you and you take off your stuff that doesn't work it's still gonna target you uh there you go fat stacks yeah everything should have bigger stacks um i believe for resources it's like five hundred thousand or nine hundred thousand nine hundred ninety nine thousand something like that it's a lot Oh yeah, let's see if this fall damage is working, or lack thereof. Hey! Uh, I like that because it just makes like getting around fun. More fun. Like getting from point A to point B where you can just like jump down the mountains. And also, I, I assume it'll add some like interesting strategies perhaps. In terms of, you know, raiding and the purge and stuff. Maybe you have to consider um, the lack of fall damage in your base build. Or maybe in order to get in your base. Um, well, that doesn't really make sense, I guess. Because nobody has fall damage. Ooh, and you call that a knife? talking about I got on my my light that's the other nice thing about this is it breaks barrels a little quicker it's just like a slight edge to a start is all that's all I was going for and I think I've accomplished that Hmm. Now I have no base plans. Now do I build... Normally I like to build at the the head. Head's the top, right? The head of a river. Where am I going? Which one's the top? Anyways, like where the water is coming from. Uh, 
whenever I build on a on a river. However, in this case, because it's too like meeting, it might be cool to like build um, build in between them. Um, damn, I got no cloth. <laughs> Wait, did I turn admin stuff off? I didn't. Oh, uh, does that mean no? I could still see this. I thought, yeah. I mean, it's not a huge deal. I, I, I don't mind. And then maybe if other players join, I can I can see them as well. That's kind of fun. Is that a bad thing? Maybe. Yeah, I should turn it off. I don't want any complaints. And uh, just on the, that note, I'm not going to participate. Yeah, why does that not work, though? Okay, I'm going to have to look on to how to turn that off. No big deal now. It's just me and my buddy, so. Um, I'm not going to participate. I, I know some people have issues with uh, admins playing on their own servers. And as I say, this is like, you know, one step away from a private server. Oh, shoot. Oops. Oops. Is there a recycler at dome? I see a wolf. Um. Yeah, some people have a problem with that. And I feel like on a PvP server, kind of like, I would even say rightly so. <laughs> Just because, you know, there's got to be that temptation to give yourself an AK. Say the same guy kills you a bunch of time. Give yourself an AK or, you know, 100 C4 and demolish his base. I guess I should put some shorts on. Where are those from? Why does that look familiar? Hmm. Uh, but on a PvE server, you know, what am I going to do? The, the only thing I could do is when per you know, participate and destroy players bases which feels wrong and you know if, if you have never watched any of my stuff and this is the first thing you're watching uh i feel like you if you are suspicious of me that i would do something like that yeah that, that, that's fine the human nature that sort of thing however if you are a long time viewer if such a person exists first of all thank you and i love you uh, second of all, I, I, I think you could probably, just from watching my stuff, get the impression that that's not the sort of thing I would do. I, I don't, I don't roll like that, I guess you would say. Oh, I hear a helicopter. Oh, you know what I... that reminds me. Um, I wanted to turn on the... Not that. Not that. Am I in rest? Not that. Where is the... Is it this one? Yeah. We need our wave sounds. We're on an island, after all. An island of this size... If you were to actually live on it... An island that you can, you know, you can walk across in however many minutes it would take me to actually walk across this. You'd be here in waves. Yeah, uh, this is a big map too. Fairly sizable. <laughs> Which I decided, uh, I'm gonna go between 4,500 and 6,000 for my maps. I like a big map. More places to build. cooler stuff potential looking at you know custom maps too but those you gotta pay for but, uh, yeah there is things that I am you know potentially eventually willing to pay for and this is not a I should say like I'm never gonna be asking for money for this this is a, a purely because I want to do it thing and it's a not a money making thing and uh, it's not a cheap thing either, <laughs> having a uh, server. Like it's like, uh, especially because of the exchange rate, it certainly doesn't help me to Canadian. 
Well, you can look in for into it yourself, but I uh, I didn't go the cheapest option because I wanted two 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 main reasons that I couldn't go the cheap option. I wanted a big map. Uh, you could go cheap hosting with a small map, a lot easier, which sort of makes sense in terms of just size. Oh, look at that river. Oh yeah. Wee. Oh, well, one thing I did is I didn't put anywhere that there's no fall damage. Like, I didn't put it at any of the descriptions or plug-in info or anything like that. Because I thought it would be just sort of like a fun surprise. Like, people fall to what they think is going to be their death and then just take no damage. <laughs> um, am I close to getting out of the cold here? I'm going to be getting dark soon. I'm going to be getting dark... I'm in the winter, and I'm wearing shorts. With a one and a shield on it. That's from, like, a... Wait, does it say what they are? No. I feel like that's familiar to me for some reason. Is it, like, a card battle game? I don't know. What was I saying? <laughs> I know at one point there I was mid-sentence. And then switched over to another sentence. And now I've forgotten what the original sentence is. And that's just what's going to happen from time to time. There's nothing I can do about it. Oh, uh, one of the reasons I added wolves to mon monuments is because I felt like the animal spawns. Like, we haven't even seen an animal, have we? Yeah, I feel like the animal spawns are, like, not non-existence. At least during my testing, but like really low. Or is it just because the spawns are normal, but the map is huge, so they're further between? Is that possible? I don't know. Yeah, I haven't seen a single polar bear out here. There you go, got a nice 200 scrap already. Should I be putting any of this in my backpack? Anything I'm dying to keep here? No, oh, not yet. Alright, getting out of the cold at least. Time for, oh, is that a bear right there? Speak of the devil? Oh, okay, cloth. Yeah, bow would bow would go good right now. Just need like one more claw. I see you, bear. Oh, this is a nice area down here. Look at this. Idyllic. Idyllic, you might say. We won't be worrying about food either. All these pumpkins. Oh. Let's scare this bear away. Hello, bear. Classic bear trick. Uh, okay, so with foundation limits, <laughs> normally I would just leave this here, but maybe I should uh, do that. Okay, so I could build at the top of that. It was nice up there. But I do feel like being down here is better in this particular case. <laughs> yeah. And then maybe I'll have what, a bridge here. And a bridge here. And then my base in between. That's interesting. What about... Oh, get these rocks involved, maybe. Okay, how... Uh, where's the line? It's probably pretty far, right? Oh, yeah. Okay, okay.
Hmm. This looks interesting. This little nook here. Or this little plateau here. A bear. Uh, I should <laughs> definitely get a bag going. So I don't have to run all the way back here. Alright, what's what's up with us? Can I get up with this? Hey bear. I got a crafting bonus for that. Yeah, you see my crafting's pretty good because I don't really craft much. Oh, blueprints. Okay, this is just common, right? Yeah. Okay. I did uh, wipe them. I wanted to make sure that they did wipe. Hmm. Okay. Where would I recycle? I'm lining up poster junkyard, not too far. Alright, I'm in the right area, but I'm just not 100% sure. Do I want to build up here? A little pain to get up and down, though. Could build stairs. Well, down's easy, I just jump. Uh, this little nook is kind of cool. Although. This, I feel like, is where I want to be. And then I can have, like, a little boat base here or something. Yeah, I'll tell you what. Let's just go to the head of this river, see if there's anything cool. Should have this out in case I'm attacked. In case I'm brutally attacked. Uh, you know what? I don't think I want to build up here. It's nice. And I've done that before. Like, often. Try to get the, uh, the little waterfall, like, in your base. That's kind of fun. It's a water feature. Okay, yeah, so I'm feeling this, like, little nook here. For the time being, let me just throw this in a bush. There you go. Uh, Moses. This is where Moses was in the reeds. Huh? References. Okay, so let's go get a bunch of wood. Oh, got a fair amount. Uh, you know what? I'll make a TC. And a lot. And some more cloth would be great. There's not a recycler at this, is there? I don't think there is. I could, uh, could I put one? <laughs> oh, it's night time. Oh, shoot. Okay, well, we haven't seen any zombies yet, but they should actually be out. Oh, you know what? I'm, close, I'm pretty close to fishing village. So you have the, uh, when you uh, install the plugin, um, night zombies, you have the option for, like, scientists and, like, turrets at safe zones to target them. And the, the default is actually off, but I thought it'd be cool if it did. So... 
you could occasionally see a scientist fighting a zombie. That's, you know, interesting. I suppose. What are the gallery rates of these? So 30... 20. Okay, yeah. That's the other reason that I like uh, mining hat as part of your kit. is because... Uh, you know, you're, you're doing your nighttime uh, wood gather. And you can see what you're doing a bit better. Oh shit. God damn it. <laughs> Alright, I was prepared for zombies, so. Uh, I got no heals either, which is the other issue. Alright, uh, that'll get us started. I'll worry about stone after. Yikes. <laughs> that really jumped out at me there. That's what I hate about bears. Or wolves. Or anything that's attacking. When it comes out of the bushes like that. Okay, I'm thinking maybe a sunken TC might be interesting. I think I've done that before. So we'll see. Okay, so I would go, go here, here, here. Interesting. Alright. I think I might have to start over. What do I want here? Do I want just stairs coming up? I mean, I could build better here, couldn't I? And then worry about stairs after. Yeah, that's probably probably the smart move. Oh. Okay, now that means I need to decide what sort of base to build. Um, yeah, I kind of wouldn't mind ways both in both up and down. So a way that I can get up the cliff and a way I can get down the cliff. Okay, I kind of like that. I can go down one, I saw. Oh, that would be nice. Uh, or maybe it's just like that. And you come up there. Mm-hmm. You see there, maybe. I wish I could do that. Yeah, so this is the way up. In through here. Yeah. Your your classic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, airdrop would actually be nice. It's funny, the last I was thinking about this yesterday. The last like I don't know, like I I feel like every wipe I've recorded actually, so this is number four. So the last three, um, Okay, that's better. Yeah, yeah. Then maybe a door here and window there. Yeah, I like that. Anyways, the last uh, three wipes I've recorded, I've got airdrops on the first day, like every single one of them. Which is maybe not too surprising. They're, uh... Yeah, this is kind of cool. TC in here. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Uh, what do I got? Stone. Alright. 
safe and secure now. Um, <clears throat> Damn, that would have been nice. What are these? Okay, okay. Interesting, interesting. Yeah, you get up there pretty easily. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right, let's consider this direction. Yes. Yes. Um. You know what? I'll save that for a, uh, which I'm a thing, uh, not a furnace, uh, oil refinery. Yeah, do I want a door out here? Door out here, this could be a little patio or something. <laughs> oh, there's the airdrop. I don't think I'm gonna go for it. the classic yeah I love a, 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 a corner window like that like that uh, stairs or ramp like stairs and then where's the exit it is like here that's weird right then you gotta kind of car out crawl through it yeah I kind of like that it's interesting like I've uh, I don't think I've done that before um okay okay so Yeah, that's, that's one of the reasons it's always fun to build um, in the rocks is because you're going to end up with like crazy stuff. Okay, so one thing is this is not going to be a very secure base. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I did not hear that. These bears, man. I guess that's the one thing about river, living by the river. Uh, there's gonna be bears. Okay, so. Yeah. Interesting. So this is if you want to come out on top. I guess I'm going to do half walls there, there, there. So have I just decided this is going to be two stories? I don't know how often I'm going to be coming out on top, but... Surely I could put a wall there. Oh, I saw blue. Nice. Nice. Um, this could be... Maybe this will be electrical. That's the cool room. Which, on the note of electrical, I'm thinking I'll maybe just save up. Um, for the uh, test generator. Do I want to do double window? Yeah. OK. 
Okay. That's it. We're doing for wood. Entrance, maybe like big inside with like turrets, might be nice. Do your classic there just to make it perfectly square. Then I think what I would do as well is I don't know if I got enough wood for this. I'll do a honeycomb layer on top. I gotta kind of leave it open. Alright. Hey, it was bound to happen sooner or later. Um, bears? <laughs> oh, we got some good nodes up here, too. So maybe um, a turret or two up top. Uh, can I get onto this from here? Mm -hmm. What? Anti-hack? I'm not hacking, I swear to God. Uh, because while I'm not going to participate in the rating of others, um, I do enjoy the being rated, or at the very least, attempting to prevent being rated. It's, a, it's sort of a fun goal. Alright. Did I get them all? Yeah. Alright. Uh, I'm going to save putting the, the top on, though, because obviously... All right, so issue is, oh wait, I need a, uh, okay, so up top will be landing pad as well. Yeah, so I'll, I'll quite often be landing up top. Now, on that note, oh yeah, I could get really, uh, Really serious about this and put those on, right? Alright. Oh. Forgot to copy and paste that. So, where would I want to come down? Maybe here? From the. like when I land. So there, uh, I was hoping that would work. Do I need this? Yeah. Okay, so that's not gonna work, I don't think. This is interesting. Yeah, maybe I just like. So I fly, land up here, just come down, come down here. You gotta kinda sneak under, maybe put shotgun traps here. Like facing this way. Okay, okay. Yeah, I kinda like that. It's interesting. If anything. Let's put 
headphones. Yeah. <laughs> that would be nice if I could get one there. It's just too... Uh... No. Okay, okay. We tried. Yeah. Park up there, come down. That, that blocks a little bit. Okay, I, I like it, I like it. It's interesting. Then you go to come in here. This is definitely what they call free ball on it. <laughs> they don't actually call it that, but. Okay, and then they hop down here. There. There. You can see into the open core question mark. Okay, where is loot? is the question. Um, okay, this is what I'm feeling. Um, I'm feeling that I need more wood. One of the, a lot of nice things about a PVE server. Relaxation, for me at least, number one. However, a nice thing that you're witnessing here is the ability to really get the, the skeleton down of your base. Whereas normally, if I'm on a server... I gotta go to my buddy's base there and try to kill him. <laughs> and uh, try to damage his base as well. It should be working. I mean, it was a blue point. Why it wouldn't be working now than was before, I don't know. Now, the interesting thing about these bonuses is I don't think they apply to if you're using a jackhammer or a chainsaw. So I thought it was interesting. Maybe not altogether a bad thing. The nodes, not a lot of stone nodes. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm thinking this is this is loot central over here. Um, So yeah, like this is all loot in here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, you know, loot here, loot here, loot on the stairs, freaking loot up here. You name it, there's loot. This is loot central. This will be industry. Yeah, into central industry. Uh, up there, electrical. Here, I don't know yet. 
a relaxation station or this is also where my like drop box for things to be recycled is which on that note oh um car garage hey is that food no I mean, I could do a separate, which I might end up doing. No way. Come up here, come up here. And da -da -da, da -da -da -da. All right, I think that's looking pretty good. Okay, so maybe... Car slash boat. Yeah, yeah, that might actually be cool. Car slash boat, like down here. With like a bridge across? Yeah, okay. So, on that note, do I maybe just put... Put this down. Um, just thinking which way I want the car to come out. It would probably drive that way. Which means two, three. I have a side block. Wait, you place four foundations so you can place up to 50. But it's not counting those up there? In my weird little base? Okay, yes, yeah, so car left there. I have to make another TC. Uh, and then this is obviously going to have to go. Oh, nice. Drops off pretty quick. Um. Oh. Too close to the fishing village. Okay, do you think that's enough? Hmm. No, I think that'll be enough. Let's get a boat in. Uh, Depth-wise is what I was worried about. Yeah. Well, that looks pretty good. basics down just so that uh, no one can take it from me. storage there. I mean, don't need a lot of boat storage. Maybe uh, once I do have the test generator, I think it might fit there. I'm going to hop on that. 
Bing, bing, boom. Bing, bang, boom. Bing, bang, boom. All right. Uh, yeah, we'll need that. Look at that last one. Uh, I'm sure Carl will get... Yeah. Carl can make that. All right. I thought I just saw someone. I'm seeing things. I've been on this island too long. Okay. All right, now the hunt for stone. What is a stone hatchet? Uh, okay, so this is 20. Whoops. Maybe I should go recycle. And then research, uh... Yeah, I got all my stuff on me, right? Yeah, maybe I go recycle. Get a bunch of cloth and get a bow. Um... Yeah, I thought I have a great amount to recycle. But while I'm there, I'll probably get more. Which, on that note, where am I going? So, follow this. I'll go, uh... Mining outposts. Yeah, mining outposts. Getting things along the way. Because that way I can get a metal pickaxe. Maybe I'll find a salvage pickaxe. That would be great. But, you know, so far feeling good. Feeling like progress has been made. is what I need. Cloth and bow. I suppose I could have gone for that airdrop. Oh, shoot. Yeah, I definitely need cloth. Um, because I definitely need a bow. Because wolves. Because wolves. Uh, I guess they're not at fishing outposts, that's good. Does one of the fishing outposts, like just large fishing outposts, fishing village, get a recycler normally? Like I've seen, I'm positive I've seen recyclers uh, at fishing villages. But I just don't know. Doesn't look like there's one here. No. Okay. Might do that at some point. Don't know if I've ever done that. I have um, another thing I want to test. I have a friend who is like deathly afraid of sharks. So if they ever want to play on the server, uh, I have removed sharks. So I believe that's the one that. You need diving stuff. Uh, you know what? Let me just do this. Okay, I really need cloth. Although I suppose if I lure the wolves... Oh, I just saw cloth. Yes. If I lure the wolves away far enough from the outpost that I could build, I could put down a foundation. And then they would run away if I hop on it. That's something. Or I just get 50 cloth and then shoot them with arrows. That's my game plan. Uh, the other issue is... I put... Five wolves? <laughs> uh... I mean, up to five. I don't think it necessarily has to be five exactly. Up to five wolves. 
at the uh, monuments, meaning um, like three can be a challenge, even when you're, you know, fully kitted out. Not a challenge, but you can't ignore three. Yeah, that's a good way to put it. One wolf gnawing at you, you're probably going to be all right. But when it's three, you're probably not going to be all right. Mm, take that. Look for barrels. Okay, yeah, where am I going? Blue. I could rush in with my savage axe. See him there. Hmm. <laughs> I could just rush up. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Go throw these axes at him. Um. Oh. Brag. <laughs> what do I have that I can hit him with? It's just if I get close, he's gonna hit me. I think I might be in trouble there. <laughs> Go away. We don't want any. <laughs> I think if I'm within... Okay, maybe I gotta turn the wolves down. Frank. Um... Okay, wait. Damn it. Okay, well, not an ideal start in terms of wolves. Eventually, it's going to be like, oh, cool, there's wolves here. Gives me, uh, gives me some meat, or <laughs> gives me some cloth that I need. Or, hi uh, or I can make some low grade. I was also thinking of adding, uh, I think I saw a plugin where it was like uh, animals drop loot, which is kind of cool. Uh, now my loot there should be protected as well. Like, if someone were to come along and find my body, it should be fine. I feel like I could practically just run in now and finish them off. salvage whatever sword thing would be nice hey assholes get back here oh sure now you're running where'd you go what the hell 
I can hear them. Get over here. Oh. This might not have been wise. Alright, I think I'm alright. Alright. Um Now, one thing you gotta worry about in this case is that I think that wolf that ran away might come back. And it, I think I just heard it. Maybe I didn't. And wolves while you're recycling are a pain in the ass. Oh yeah, fast recycling. Lest we forget. A, uh, it's a bow right there. Did I make that boat? No. <laughs> uh, another plugin I thought looked interesting. Like, I've looked at so many. Like, a ridiculous amount. Hundreds? Probably. Um was that uh, it was like called the cannibal plugin something like that effect. that means like you could like kill people and eat their meat and you get certain bonuses from doing so Definitely hear a wolf. I definitely did hear that wolf. Okay, I think I'm gonna have to turn wolves down, it seems. Anyway, let's go back to recycling. Basically just recycling everything to start. Get some metal, get some boxes going. Uh, actually should... Oh, well. can even do these. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> 
Okay, good enough for a furnace. Um, Do they respawn when I'm here? They shouldn't. That's uh, suddenly surrounded by five wolves. Wolfas. One of the issues as well is that I have I got no like armor on or anything. Maybe I can aid that. on my old fit. Could put that on. Good bite protection, right? Oh, that's interesting. So it offers the same protection, but you don't need rope. Now yeah, we'll make one, right? <laughs> I hear you. Okay, well now you're screwed. That's the difference. Why am I still hearing a wolf out there? <laughs> now we're talking. Nice. All right. Uh, the only thing I don't like about this, which maybe that is offset by the not needing rope, is you can't like ride a horse with this on. I don't know if you know that. Do you notice that? Okay. I think I'm good. Oh, I'm still hearing wolves. Alright, let's get home with our goodies, I think. Oh, shelf I kind of do want, I think. Oh, nice. Fireplace for my bedroom. All right, yeah. A few little odds and ends at the end there. Oh, I forgot to mark my home. Let's do that when I get back. Okay, so this should be enough. Yeah, I should have enough for tier one and to research uh, metal pickaxe. We should be able to get some boxes down. Progress. That's all it is on day one. These uh, incremental steps. Maybe that's why I like it. It's sort of... You know the steps that you want to make. 
It's just going about them. It's like a puzzle look in some ways, which is nice. to get some doors on at some point. Probably be wise. Alright, alright. Um, let's get that tier one down. What do I need? I think that. Alright, where is our you know how I like a, uh, maybe here, I like a uh, workbench bay, <laughs> bay, yeah that might actually not, not be a bad right here, or put it in here, yeah maybe these three, um, kind of depends to be honest. Can I get this in? I can. Okay, yeah, maybe this is it. So, one, two, three, workbench bays. So then, what's the industry that's going on here? I guess furnaces. Ooh, maybe, uh... Well, I don't know if I was planning on doing any farming, but... We have a four farm here, or a two farm even. Interesting. A lot of empty headspace that's not being used. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, okay, yeah. Is along here. Uh, yeah, maybe three electrical and then a bunch of there. I'm thinking this, yeah, we were thinking this was. Uh, I should wait. Let's get one box down. And um, by that I mean one barrel. I think I can get a barrel there. So I'm not carrying everything I own. Yeah, nice. Uh, ding, ding. Ding, I'm a little more ready to head out now uh, for stone. Stone is our main, because I'd like to at least get the floors done. This room, though, I'm not sure about yet. Hmm. Like, should I add a floor? thing to do. But maybe it's just there. Um, but then how do you get up there? I mean, you could just hop up, but I'd like a more elegant solution, if I might. Uh, hold on one sec. Got my slanket on and I'm getting hot. Because then maybe, yeah, I do do, do do. 
Yeah, so those four. But how do I get up there? Is that one floor? It is. Hmm. <laughs> okay, I have a maybe idea. Uh, this is going the wrong way, though. Damn it. Um. No. Yeah, that's right. Then that there. That up here. Um. Yeah. No, that's that's cool. Okay, so electrical, we'll have a four farm here. This could be the water. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I like that. And that's the way out, up top. Okay, I won't be using it too often. Okay. Bones. Done. Um, I think I do want to... Just in case of bear attack. It's nice to have a plan. <laughs> a literal plan. Uh, okay, so let's go node hunting. Actually, we're near the snow. Yeah, if I head towards green, it's probably pretty good. Oh, uh... Oh yeah, yeah, idiot. Set home, home one. Hey, now I can teleport back here. Okay, okay. Uh, I should mark this as home as well. That's my classic blue, as I like to do. Home. Cool. Uh, okay, let's go to green. Go to green. Uh, should maybe get some pumpkins along the way if I can. This is going to be nice having access to pumpkins. Trying to scare them off. Okay, um, this will be a good zombie test. It actually would be kind of nice to get a zombie with a uh, coffin. Because they're good storage, and you can put them like a pie. <laughs> Plus the bonus to, uh... Bonus to farming at night. Assuming I freaking find anything to farm, Jesus. Where are my nodes at? Nice. Pumpkin rich. That feels good. Yeah. Whoops. Like building... Goddamn bears. Look at how many bears there are. You go down in the woods today. You know. 
Why would you go down there? So many bears. As the old saying goes. Yeah, like building like here and getting the... Uh, like the waterfall in your base. Kind of looks cool. It's a water feature, you might say. Alright, notage. Say we like farm all night. Do the old night farm. It's like night moves, but with the farm. Eventually, I wouldn't mind getting this whole uh, this whole building uh, high qual. I feel like in a month I could potentially. Do, oh, do any of the monuments I'm going to? Uh, I don't know if they have diesel spawns. Sort of interesting that the uh, same size map and seed generated a slightly different map because of the most recent update. Uh, has that uh, pop up popped up saying the night bonus yet? Zombies with a bow is doable, but uh, you gotta really hit them in the head. Oh, actually, yeah, as I mentioned, I turned my zombies down a bit, uh, health-wise. And they don't throw grenades, <laughs> uh, bean cans, because that was annoying. So it's in the polar bear. All right, night bonus. Nice. So does that make my skill go up quicker, or does it make my existing skill more potent, or both? I don't really know. Uh, okay, where am I going? Probably this way? Or towards yellow? Hmm. It was a dark night. How much we could say. Still no zombies. Oh. Something big in the night. Just saw a silhouette there. Uh, I know that um, wipes can uh, have issues with plugins. Well, we saw it with my uh, vendors not showing up there, for example. So I wonder if my night zombie plugin is busted up. It's actually, uh, if you have a gun, it's an easier way to find them because you just shoot it in the air. Like you just don't care. 
and uh, they have pretty good hearing, or at least it seems to draw them. Whee! It'd be fun if, like, you had this chicken thing, and uh, that prevented fall damage. Like, it was like, you know, it was like Link when he's got a chicken. You know what I mean. It's like Link when he's got a chicken. got a fair amount of stuff. <laughs> See, even though it is, you know, vanilla, the, uh, this, this really makes a nice difference. The, the Z levels. Hello? Anybody home? No? Tell you what, if we uh, see the airdrop, maybe I'll go for it. Okay, where, speaking of going, where am I? Is there any. No. No. Why don't I just head towards here ish? Yeah, we'll keep in the snow. Keep your eyes peeled for that airdrop. Oh, mm -hmm. Aurora Borealis? Well, I guess it depends on where we are in the world, isn't it? Is it Aurora Corealis, I think, if you're in the southern hemisphere? It could be wrong. It happened once before. Too much sulfur. I don't really need at this point. Wait, where's all my sulfur? Did I not get any sulfur? Oh, I'm okay. good. Huh. I thought I like at least picked up some. Okay, well, maybe I will get a note or two in preparation. Oh, back is really bothering me today. Because I was in the office yesterday. Nothing, nothing worse for your back than sitting in an office chair all day. I think I will try to do that cargo ship at some point. Once I have, you know, like a good kit and a gun and stuff. Like I want to see how it interacts with uh, the harbor there. It, like pulls in and apparently cranes puts uh, red cargo containers on the ship and you can like stow away in them. One of the, you know, one of the hardest things of One of the hardest things of uh, running cargo is getting on. <laughs> the amount of times I've seen even veteran players not make that uh, that jump onto the ladder there, like from a boat. I think, yeah, actually, no, I don't think. Every time I've made it onto cargo, uh, it has been with the power of flight. <laughs> Either uh, a mini or... Uh, on the server that I played last, White Damnation, where I had a jetpack. 
jetpack is one of the paid plugins I would like to get, but it's friggin' expensive, it's like $20. I guess it is, at least I assume it is, with plugins. It's like you buy it once and then you got it, right? Like you don't have to, if they update it, you don't have to buy it again, I think and hope. No luck on the airdrop front yet. Pretty friggin' good on the uh, stone front, though. Uh, I think when I do go home, I should check on the night zombie plugin. It definitely doesn't seem that there's any zombies out here. I guess for plugins, at least for that first one, is it basically just. You know, I'm such a, a newbie at this. Um, you uninstall it and reinstall it, and when you reinstall it, it will reinstall with any new you know, patches. That's how that works, I assume. Alright, I could probably go home. One more note, right? another reason I gotta go home. Uh, stop. Oh, I forgot to set a drink timer. Okay, so, let's see if this is working. Uh, home, home one. Nice. There you go. Do this while we wait. I do kind of like the sound that it makes. Uh, okay, so let's make... Oh, can I... Yeah, let's make one of those. They're slightly better. Oh, did I make one? Oh my god. Gary's mod tool gun. Um, and then we'll start uh, upgrading stuff. Uh, oh, wow. Look at that, eh? We're going to have a nice view. Cool. Uh, yeah, that's going to be cool. I think I need like a little patio. Okay. Uh, yeah, what am I thinking here? Well, you know, it's interesting. I was going to do Adobe because I planned on living in the, uh, in the desert. However, that's no longer the case. There you go. I'm going to want a light at the end of that at some point. Um... But now I'm not so sure. Maybe just brick? Yeah, I think brick. I've been doing a lot of brutalists. Let's switch it up to brick. Brutalist is, uh... And I feel like I heard Will Jim say this as well. It's like, when I first saw it, I didn't really like it. It's just kind of like, well, brutalist, which... Fine if you like the look, but I didn't really like the look. But uh, now that I've like used it a bunch of times, it's sort of like grown on me. All right. Um, 
Oh yeah, is everything facing the right way? I will admit that I'm not great at telling whether the twig is facing the right way. I haven't really 100% figured it out. All the other skins I can kind of tell. I have a little trouble with high qual as well. And it might be nice to do this. Um, well, I'm walking around. Oh. <sighs> stretch it out, stretch it out. Oh, what happened there? How dare you. Maybe I'll do the stairs. Yeah. Which I feel like I've done that before. I'll do the stairs, Adobe. Oh, come on now. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. Please, for the love of God. Um... So the metal, what color do we want the metal? Red? It's blue I like. White I've done. Green I don't think I've done. Just my favorite color. What does red look like? Um, no. What does it look like with this? Hmm. I thought these were more colorful, these stairs. I thought they had, like, things on the side. Yeah, like, I feel like I like those better. What else? Blue doors? No. The old standby? Uh, no. Spark. Yeah. I like the outline of it. Okay. Um, oh, you know what? And then it goes better with that red, too. Okay. Okay. You talk me into it. Tricky, but we did it. Um, okay, so is that first floor? Yeah. Mm, I think I want this this way because it's. Okay, rotated that time. Oh, did I really run out of my oh my god. Okay. Um I need this. I need Are you kidding me? Forty eight? Oh my god. Oh wait, no, no, we're alright, we're alright. Okay, so I need to build some furnaces, is what I need. That is priority at this point. Um, Cause I thought maybe I would have enough. But I don't. Okay, I need to build one furnace. <laughs> 
Okay, so I'm thinking maybe my three... Yeah, yeah, yeah. My three... Um, what are these called? Wood... My three wood ones there. Oh, I think I could build another one. One more would be great. I love doing it in threes. 32, or am I done? Okay, well, we did all right. get me going. Until I can, uh, you know, complete. Sort of sad thing there, though, is now I can't uh, metal stuff until I'm done. might have an interruption or two today. I don't know that Mrs. needed help with something, so we'll see. Well, you know what? Um, interesting, because it actually matters less on these than a normal long play that I do, because I actually do editing, or often do editing, because... Uh, I think like this one might look nice. Yeah, that one looks nice in Adobe. What about if I do the do this Adobe? Just the little area. Does it look dumb or cool? Kind of hard to tell. Uh, yeah, I think it looks cool. Yeah, like the little... I don't want to say patio, so I'm not going to. So these... No, just normal. I couldn't remember if I... Oh, oh shit. Um, if I upped the speed of smelting. I didn't think I did, but... area needs to be more protected. Alright, uh, the roofs I think I can get. From, well, the roof. Okay. Uh, 
rotate, 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 please, yes, 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 we're doing it, we're doing it, is good to me. Um, okay, so do I want... I feel like maybe these Adobe. Like the little stick-out parts. Stone one pretty quick. Jeez, a little. Okay. <laughs> I don't know if the, and I feel like I've seen this on other servers with half decay, I don't know if the TC calculation is actually accurate to the half decay, and I've seen where it isn't, and I don't know enough about decay to tell, like numbers, math, so, you know, what the hell. Oh shit, I forgot my... Okay. So I forgot my blueprint. Easily solved. Did I not make one? Known me, baby. Bear me. Uh, it would be kind of nice to kill a bear. It's just I don't. Uh, and I, I could do it, but I, I'm going to have difficulty with the bow. Oh. Did I maybe get a... Oh, maybe get a bust of one. Let's chase after this one, just because um, I did get a lot of hits in. So. Damn it. They are so fast, though. <laughs> bears. Bears that you've shot and are running. Oh! The river might help. Sometimes they go into the river and then that like really slows them down, but Alright. I think I lost them. He took out my arrows too. Now the only <laughs> silver lining is if I ever come across him again. It'll be very low health. 
Alright, or something. Cope. Copium. Perhaps. I haven't seen a boar yet either. At least a boar would give me some uh, stone. Almost done, at least, in terms of getting uh, everything stoned. Which is not too bad for two hours in for a base this size. I'm, ha I'm happy. I'm happy with that progress. And the relaxation. Oh man, we got rain, we got waves. Are you kidding me? Whew. <laughs> it's one of those weird little... I don't know what that is. Some of the terrain is occasionally weird. I've been uh, watching or like coming across, like not seeking out, but I keep seeing like uh, ultra high res, you know, RTX 4080, uh, like Minecraft servers or setups where it's like it's so beautiful and like realistic looking practically but then it's still underneath all that beauty is Minecraft it's been giving me the itch to play even though I don't think I could achieve those settings although I got a, I got a pretty decent uh, rig I got an Alienware which you know some people like some people hate it's a Dell though Every time I haven't purchased a Dell, dude, we're getting a Dell. Every time I haven't purchased a Dell, I've had issues. Every time I have purchased a Dell, I don't think I've ever had issues. It's sort of the same reason that I drive a Toyota Corolla. Uh, reliability is number one on my list of desired traits and any expensive thing. <laughs> Be it a car or a PC. Give me that reliability, please. Uh, which I'm starting to think, on that note, I might need a new phone. My phone's been acting up a little bit. I've had it for... Uh, it's an iPhone XS, I think it is? I don't know. So I've had it for a long time, and I don't really have any desire for a new one. Like, it does everything I need a phone to do. However, it's starting to get a little uh, funky from time to time where, like, like I won't be able to close it. <laughs> like, I'll, I'll hit the turn the screen off button and nothing will happen. Or I'll hold down to uh, talk to uh, Siri there. Like, I use Siri to set alarms often, as you've heard if you're a long-time listener. And, uh, it just, it just won't work. Uh, YouTube often gives me issues, too, where... It won't, uh, like, dis it, the video will, will play, but, like, the information underneath and, like, comments and all that, like, stuff that's normally below a video just won't show up. That's kind of a weird one. I don't know if that's phone-related, but it didn't always happen. Why are you watching this? <laughs> that's my question to you. I assume it's just the relaxation. Which I get, because I do watch stuff like this, like just people chilling, playing things, 
rain sounds, wave sounds. Like I have my own before bed. I call it a what do I call it like a long play playlist. It's not all long plays. There's like music on it. Oh man, the Dwarf Fortress soundtrack. Someone bought the album, like the actual physical LP vinyl album. And they put it on and just sort of recorded it. And it sounds like really good. That's that's a good before bed, sleepy time. I find a before bed sleepy long play playlist. It's like a very personal thing. And like what might suit you, others will see oh you it's insane, where are you watching this? And there's also different, like, at least for me, it's all from my perspective, because that's the only perspective I can know. Uh, there's different, like, flavors of things on it. And I sort of really let my subconscious decide what I'm going to watch. For example, I think, yeah, this is probably a good example. Uh, Persona 5 which I did long play on this channel. Feel free to watch. I think it came out okay, that series. Um, I didn't beat it, though, because it was like, oh, hey, look at that, clerk's on. Let me give him a bonjour. Bonjour! Um, but I was interested in the story still, so I, uh, found some some individual who basically edited out all gameplay. Wow, well, still haven't seen a polar bear. Imagine this was my bear and it dies in one shot. Uh oh. Well, he's pretty low. Hey, that's gonna be good. Good goodies there. I think I can maybe go home soon. What am I doing? 35. Yeah, so I added this, uh, just the cinematics and story, I guess you would say, of Persona 5 to the playlist. It's 29 hours long. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Which I don't even know how they loaded something so long. Uh, I think you need to, like, contact YouTube and get permission to load something that long, or the ability to. Because I have a 12-hour Baldur's Gate 3 episode, and it's actually 11 hours and 59 minutes long, or thereabouts, because I had to edit out some, because you can't upload a video more than 12 hours long, by default. Anyways, my brain will periodically tell me when I have the itch to watch some of that. I'm never, like, at night time making the conscious decision of, like, oh yeah, I want to watch that tonight. I'll just be scrolling through my, this, this playlist I have created and be like, oh yeah, okay, I have the itch. And I, and you know what? It's, a lot of the times it'll be, oh, the itch is developing. I feel the itch starting, but I'm not ready yet. And then one day it'll just hit me, and then I'll watch it. And then maybe a week or two, or even longer and some, for some of the videos, will pass. I don't really need Silver yet. Um, and the itch, you know, slowly builds over time. Some videos, this Dwarf Fortress one, for example, uh, soundtrack, I'll leave on the list. I'll, you know, listen to the whole thing, and then I'll leave on the list because I'll know I'll want to visit it later. Some things, like, say, a uh, Minecraft uh, build, rainy build, which I like watching. So picture what I'm doing now, but in Minecraft, basically. Um, those, when I'm done, I'll remove them from the list. There's some things on the list 
And this I find weird. The weirdest of all. That I've never even watched. And they've been on there for years. But they're like... What if I want to watch them? What if one day I'm in the mood? What if one day the itch develops to watch this particular thing? Uh, what's an example of that? There's one of... Uh, and I don't know if this would be a good before bedtime thing, and maybe that's why I haven't started it yet. It's a J. Schlatt watching high school, video game high school. I forget what the name of the show is. It's like 12 hours in a while. There's some, uh, like, super, super long ones. Ooh, Bear in the River is often good because they're slow. Oh, he's right up the edge, though. So many bears. It's a little bit. Alright, yeah, sort of taking shape up there. What are we doing for arrows? Doing okay. Ooh, that one must have been low. I think this should be enough to get us uh, fully decked out, right? Let's go. Then we'll get some wooden doors on. Just because I don't want people peeking in and seeing my uh, where my TC is. Should I one day be raided? Let's do the old work our way in. Now eventually the roof, the, the actual top top, all have high claw. But then these inner parts will not be, it'll still be brick, which I guess I'm okay with. I could always use the remove tool to remove and then upgrade everything, but I'm probably too lazy to do that. And that's okay. Do I have wood on me? Yeah, I do. Do I have enough wood on me? Cool. This will be my little landing pad. And I eventually can afford a heli. Maybe I'll buy an attack heli. The only thing I don't like about those is they always seem to tip over. And I don't know if... It doesn't seem like there's a way to get them back up again. Like, I've even experimented with, like... Okay. Uh, with, like, uh... Trying to use explosives to, like, blow them up right. But nothing ever seems to work. Okay, um... So, yeah, let's do these, like... Let's see what it does mean, maybe. Really not. And then we'll have a little... Yeah, on the sides. Eh, kind of like that. <clears throat> maybe I can have... Well, I'm probably going to pump from the river. If I do, uh, yeah, I'll probably do that. I was just thinking I could have a row of, uh, like, water catchers here, but no, I don't really need that. Okay, so, let's see about metal. Mm. Mm. 
we're slowly getting that out. Um, how did that not go out? Oh, because of the metal. Um, two days. Build doors. Yeah, we'll just do two doors for now. Um, do I have that middle on me? No. Okay, I am gonna do at the very least this one. Okay, I gotta remember that's how I get up. Hmm, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get out that door until I have a garage door. That's interesting. Alright, so by the way. Let's build one of these. Build one of these. Build two of these. And boy, I need more wood. Oh, and then those I'm gonna need. Okay, so we, we do still need stuff. Needless to say. We're good to get a door on, though. Um... Wait, where did I build three locks? Can't lock these still, right? No. Okay, I'm gonna put a door here, but I kinda don't know if I can get out. Oh, wow. <laughs> that couldn't have been closer. Okay, that's cool, because that means eventually I'll be able to have a... Uh, uh, which my thing? A sword. Or high qual door. There. All right. Let's go back out. Uh, I actually have to go to the washroom. So you just enjoy this lovely fire. Airdrop. Oh man, that would be nice. pickaxe not too long all right i guess wood we should focus on for a second
Doesn't this song kind of sound like the Minecraft song? Or a Minecraft song a bit? <laughs> Speaking of... I will sell teas. Maybe I'll sell teas. I don't know. It's been a while since I've done that. Cloth farm. Mm -hmm. I think cloth farm you might not need as much because, uh, well, the wolves. But when you do find animals. get a lot of resources from them. It, especially if you have the skinning. Uh, like you see, I'm only at level 4 skinning. That's already giving me a pretty decent bonus. Oh, airdrop? Oh. <laughs> you know what? I've had this... Oh, I really should... Okay, I'm not going to do it now. Which is the problem. I have this like little piece of fluff or something my on my screen and I feel like it's been there for a while and like when I do this it sort of looks like a very far away airdrop in the sky so like now I can't right now I can't see it it's got to be like on a, a white background basically Get this like cluster done, maybe. Do I need to put bars? Do I need to put window bars? Just so no one can hop in. I mean, if someone did hop in, that uh, the, the, the PBE plugins are such that they can't really do anything. Just uh, the only thing I guess I kind of want to avoid is potential future raiders knowing the layout of everything. not relaxing stuff. I can't believe we got such a rainy day too. That's been nice. Like it's been raining a lot. There is a, I did find commands that, I don't know if it's commands or a plugin or both actually in, in my travels. The one that I used to use where you would type uh, backslash env, I can't find that plugin anywhere. I think it was a paid one as well. I could be wrong. But uh, I haven't been able to find it. Which is weird because I've literally found it on multiple occasions and sent it to server owners and saying, can you install this? <laughs> I mean, in a nice way. And I offered to pay if there is an associated price, which I kind of don't think there was for that one. It just lets you control the time of day and all the weather elements and lighting and stuff like that. I used it for a lot of my... If you look back at other rest videos, you'll see it's almost always raining. And a lot of the time it's dusk or dawn. So it was a rainbow. Oh well, I didn't realize I had 32,000. <laughs> Be good for wood for a bit. Why did I want all this wood? Oh, yeah, bars. Probably more than I'm gonna need. Yeah, I like this little 
kind of hidden entrance under here, right? Kind of like a line of uh, shotgun traps. So four, is it just the five? Yeah, five. Uh, let's make another door. Let's make five of these. Um, I think I do have enough for a third. Um, the last door is for this. Um, I have a, that extra key lock that I made for some reason. I mean, obviously I'm going to use it eventually. Can you see TC from these windows? I don't think you can. No. And no. Okay. And yeah, there's no windows up here, right? Well, I guess I should make another one for there. Uh, I could just leave it blank until I get a better one. No, I like having one. Yeah, eventually I'll get metal, uh, metal bars. Or not bars, but like the, the metal window. Eventually maybe even do the, uh, high call. But for now, that's good. Uh, alright, yes, yeah, since I killed bears. 108? Oh, wow. It's gonna make all sorts of goodies. Alright, so what are we low on? Why is that going down so fast? I don't think it should be going down that fast. I wonder if... Hmm. My decay got set to, like, extra. Because <laughs> that seems like it's too fast. Five days. Yeah, I've never seen it tick down like that, I feel like. Okay, maybe I'll have to look into that. Uh, definitely knew there would be some fiddly bits, right? Goes without saying. Meaning, of course, uh, the setup of a server is not going to be super simple. Um... Okay, so, let me just uh, go and look at my server, files, outside, config, so, I forget what this one's called, it's something decay, no decay called no decay I don't have it set to uh, uh, use permissions decay if there is no owner permissions no decay cupboard range required okay wait that's wrong true uh, twig so point five point five save. I think maybe I had a thing set wrong. Black covered wood. Twig point five point five point five. It should be half. Well twig I left it. Normal decay. Okay, so now if I go to console. Let's see. Uh, reload. No decay. Successfully. Loaded plugin. No decay. Okay. Does that still seem like it's going down too? 
I mean, I guess I trust the five days, right? Do I? Hmm. Be nice to get my uh, refinery in there. You still gotta test that patrol heli. Meaning, um, make sure that it's, it's not gonna attack me if I don't attack it. Okay. So, what is the. That doesn't seem like it's working. Am I crazy? Do they add seconds? Is that what it is? Am I crazy? Rust tool cupboard added seconds. past 24 hours. Um, I know there's the tool covered new skin. I don't know, that just seems like I don't ever remember seeing a countdown like that. Uh, it, does the math make sense? So five days, it's... Uh, you know what? Calculator right here. So were I to seven eight one four times five thirty nine thousand. Yeah, okay. I guess it, the math makes sense. Hmm. Like I don't see these going down at a norm a strange or quick rate. Okay, is it it's nighttime, right? What should I do with my knights? <sighs> Farm, probably. Oh, you know what? Um, I'm gonna say... Let me know if you see any zombies. I did not last night. So, but again, maybe borked. Uh, actually, I think I could check that. Let's just see. I think it's called Night Zombies. So, were I to. Night Zombies. Successful. There is an error. Okay. So. Um, how did I fix that last one? Oh, yeah. Just. Um, like, oh, night zombies. Just removed. And re-added. Okay. So uninstall. Install. Console. Yeah, uh, he said he's never seen any. I need to be uninstalled and reinstalled to update. Oh, uh... Shop is... 
down there. Again. And luckily, did not have to start from scratch. Alright, so there may be zombies out now. Uh, you know what? I, I don't know if they're going to be there immediately. Yes, they are. <laughs> At least one, anyways. I just checked the console and there was a, a zombie killed by a scientist. It's sort of interesting that it like runs down. Oh, man. It was a dark and stormy night. Literally. Okay, how do I get a gun? <laughs> Is there a crate anywhere? No. I should consider, like, normally I would focus more on saving scrap to tech tree things, but I should consider. Well, you know, maybe we we'll go to Lighthouse. It's just going to be chickens there. And I'll uh, farm along the way. Maybe. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, uh, focus on getting myself a scra uh, scrap helicopter or a mini. Might be smart. Because then if I do see a crate spawn I could fly there yeah if I was smart gears is nice The thing about zombies is, yeah, I walked up there last night and then I had to walk home. What? Oh, 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 oh. You, uh, set home? No? Yeah. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> the amount of times I've forgotten to do that is not zero. So let's cut him some slack. As I've said before, uh, Clark there is like my uh, lucky llama in that he doesn't talk, uh, with the exception of him not being good at the game. <laughs> Uh, he doesn't uh, have quite as many hours as me, but he's uh, he's probably better at PvP, I bet, because he actually, you know, does it from time to time. Whereas I, not so much. Uh, I think what's going to be nice eventually, I think I'll be able to do, yeah, probably, is getting, like, one or two, like, giant stacks of resources. Oh, yeah, look. Okay, so let's see how many chickens are here. Now, I set it to 10, but I don't know. Are they going to be, like, underwater? Like, other times I've checked, and it didn't seem like there was 10. Oh, well, this is quite, like, a, quite a hike. You could build, like, out here, though. Excuse me. Hmm. Another potential cool one would be, I wonder if there's one that lets you like breathe underwater. I know there's those skill trees where one of the skills is to breathe underwater. Or to not have to breathe. You can build pretty close to this game. Yeah, look, look at how close. Imagine your base was right here. You'd be home by now. Oh, it's code. 
Uh, underwater chickens? No. One reason I didn't want to put wolves on lighthouse is because when they are underwater and they still attack you, you can't attack them back. Which is annoying. <laughs> Boonie hat? Just to see the skin, right? Oh, I should get a green card while I'm here. What can I run with a green card? I can get I can get a green card here and a green card here. Is there something at Harbor to run? Yeah. Hey. <laughs> Cannibalism. There you go. Just to get my skinning up, probably not a bad idea. So if I had a chosen wolves, would they have spawned there? That's kind of scary. Maybe I do gotta turn the wolves down though. It's so loud in here. Will you turn the wolves down? <laughs> Little polar bear? Uh I wish it like told you what it was. Does it have like a little hat on? Regardless, we gotta put that hat on, right? Oh, disconnected. Is that a, hopefully that was a purposeful disconnect. Um, I know he's uh, got kids in the often, or daily. I don't know what kids. I don't have them. <laughs> Has to get them ready for school. Get them out to the bus and such. Short. Oh, it's another. Ah, oh, nice. Okay, I'm gonna keep that. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna do this. Keep, keep. Don't keep, don't keep. Eh, eh, eh. <laughs> That's when you know you're on a dead server when none of the doors are open yet. I mean, it being dead is not too surprising. Brand new. Not everyone likes PvE. I'm, I'm, I'm honestly, like, not too worried about it. Oh, nice. Because this is for me, and I have invited... I have invited friends. Uh, including friends who've never played and maybe want to learn. Because this... Probably a good environment to learn. Although, um, oh, wait, no fall damage. If you want to learn, like, an actual... Um, that's what I'm looking for like real server this would not be a good place to do that like the ex the exact rules as they are probably not your best bet um, do I have enough? I don't know if I have enough it's 750 for I left well I had to come up with prices for a lot of things like you can buy a mini at bandit camp so i just use the same price oh let's go home oh he just got a mini okay cool all right i should consider doing the same if i have enough I don't. <laughs> okay. I guess, like, wood is kind of what I need now. Yeah, 
we're doing a bit better with that. Or not wood, uh, stone. I could always buy stone. What does, uh, what does stone cost? Man. <laughs> It'll take me a while to get over to there, isn't it? Um... So, could buy it for scrap. 50 for a thousand. That's not great. I feel like just, uh, yeah, let's just do a big roam. A big, uh, I'm going to make another pickaxe. Airdrop inbound. We'll keep our eyes peeled for that. Uh, I didn't really need to come over here to make that, but that's fine. Uh, yeah, yeah. So. There's Patrol Holly. Do I make my way over there? You know, I should make my way and put a bag down. Uh, I'm sure I'll have enough cloth by the time I get there. And we'll get stone along the way. Uh, will I get metal? No, mostly just stone I need. Yeah, this will be a fun journey. Assuming we don't die. <laughs> oh no, why did I bring all this? And that. Alright. At least it's safe in there. If I die. Did that just die? I'm gonna be able to... Nice. We'll take that. Should maybe put a few bags down. Um, like do a central bag. Do a bandit camp bag. Okay, so yeah, let's plan this out. We'll go bandits. Um, sort of this area, maybe. Uh, we'll do bandit. Him. Clark's Place. Yeah, Bennett, Clark's Place, across the outposts. What's this extra one that I got here? Oh, lighthouse. Okay, so purple, yellow, red. Okay, yeah, little journey. Hey, who doesn't love a journey? Oh, here's the airdrop. In the direction that we're headed, no less. Whoa. Oh, no. Why did I not have any wood on me? <laughs> run, run, run. Give me wood quick. Uh. Is he behind me? <sighs> okay, I think I'm safe. But I'm gonna get some wood. See, that's why you have wood on you. Alright. Back at it. Oh no, now I lost where that airdrop might have been. Oh, there it is. Okay, so... Damn, that's far. Um... We're gonna lose it, too. Nah, I, I don't think I'm gonna be able to get that one. Especially if I want to farm on my way, which I do. 
All right, all right. Well, big map and airdrops. Sometimes it's just too far. You know what's interesting, though? Like, the amount of times that I have just found them, like, not seen them drop, they have just been on the ground in the last couple of wipes, especially, like, day one. Enough for me to comment on it. Let's say that. stick with purple. <laughs> Should I get metal? Yeah, you know what? I'm going to wait until I have a salvaged pickaxe to worry about metal. I think we got enough to get us some boxes and stuff. Oh, a boar. Our first boar. I'm not going to go for it or anything, but it's nice to know they exist. I think we've seen... Oh, have we seen a deer yet? I actually don't think I have seen a deer. Hmm. There's probably a way... I don't know where it is, and I tentatively looked to turn up animal spawns. Like, I was able to add animal spawns to the monuments. Oh, there's that airdrop. Uh, you know what, I'm going for it. It'd really help us out to have a gun. You know what, a horse would be nice right about now. <laughs> if I just had 210 and a little bit to the left of 210, I feel like I should get it. I gotta, I gotta try though, because the difference between having a gun at the beginning and not, it can be significant, especially if I have to go to monuments. Like if, if I can go to a monument with a half decent gun, those wolves are no issue. Whereas <laughs> you saw without, well, to be fair, I was trying to kill five wolves with a melee weapon, which is but with no armor. That's not going to work out for you. Okay, so I guess we go maybe... Well, we'll see. don't necessarily need one at Bandit Camp. I mean, eventually I'd like to. Airfields... Well, watch out for wolves. Yes, they're there. I think airfield I might have put ten wolves, to be honest. I went wolf crazy. Yeah. Maybe I'll build like a little uh, one by one by Clark as well. We do gotta team up at some point. Uh, 210, right? 210 in a little bit. a sort of, uh, which I guess I'll probably put code locks on eventually, we do a sort of rough team normally, meaning we don't, or I should say rarely do we live in the same base, um, but usually we just team up anyways, and like put code locks on our bases so we can, should we need it, gain access or say, uh, I remember I needed, I was one gear short of a, uh, 
What is a windmill called? It'll call it a windmill. You know what I mean. I was one gear short and he had a bunch of gears, so I had to go over, break in while I had to go to grab a gear, that sort of thing. It's, it's teeming light. It's just I'm not good living with others. <laughs> it's not him, it's me. Um, you know, saying this as a married man as well. <laughs> Who lives with someone. It's nice when you get in your tool cupboard enough resources to last the whole life. Like when you see it, say 30 days. Okay, so oh, I wish I had binoculars. Two ten. Hmm. Yeah, this is maybe going to be harder to find. Thoughts. I think it was farther than this. Maybe if I get up on this little hill here, it'll pop out at me. A lot of dips and valleys here, though. I think it was farther. Uh, I, I think I did see a plug in that marks them on your map. But, uh. Hmm. Hmm. I don't want to go too crazy on plugins. Just medium crazy. Damn. Yeah, binoculars would have been a would have been a nice. Likely it is that I'm gonna find this. I'm gonna break my axe on this, probably. And then maybe I'll start heading to Clark's. There you go. It, maybe it's not rendered in either. Like it could be like right there, but I just can't see it because it's not rendered in. But I feel like the render distance for um, for airdrops is pretty good. If you saw it and I missed it, share that in the comments below. I will review the footage and then be like, oh man, what an idiot that guy is, I'll say to myself. Hmm. Alright, let's 
Let's go to Clark's. Oh, is that him right there? He's already got a large furnace? Jeez. I'll just scare that one off. Oh, can I maybe see it from here? It's hard to tell the distance I have found sometimes as well. Like when it's really far, it's hard to know if you've gone far enough or if you've gone too far. Oh, did that drop off? Yeah, it would be nice if a crate ended up at one of these locations. Preferably not that one, actually. Okay, let's steal all this stuff. <laughs> oh, look, he's got a refinery already. Jesus. So can I open this? Okay, that's good. That's also good. Can I steal this? Has he put a lock on it? Locked by clothing. Oh, yeah. All right. He hasn't... That's because he hasn't put a lock on it. Uh, okay, that's good. You can still take people's water. And he's got key locks, so... I suppose I could borrow his, his heli, right? <laughs> um, Alright, so yeah, let's put a little... Hey. Thought I told you to have a moose. Which wood do I have? Yeah, let's put a little one by one just so uh, if we ever need to come over here for something, we can do so. Uh, where should I put it? A little bit too close. I don't know what his plans are. Yeah, maybe I'll just put it here. throw a barrel in. Alright, you never know. Yeah. Just keep it real simple. Um, I am gonna need, uh, yeah. throw a code lock on it. So uh, if he ever needs to get in. Stop. Hammer time. Hammers take a while to make. Keeping it simple, keeping it stupid. Uh, I'll just do wood, I'll just do normal wood. Very, very simple. Very simple. Um, key lock is being made. Uh, I'm not even going to bother key locking the. days. Alright. More than I need. 
32 days. Sure. Uh, in a bag. In a bag. Room for a bag if he wants to. Uh, Clark Bass. Okay. Yeah, just a dumb little simple. A dumb little simple. Uh, throw that on there. Cool. Uh, okay, so onwards to... Get rid of that. Yeah, let's go to Outpost. Which is this direction. I never tested. I did set a limit to set house. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna double check that it is limited. Wait, did I change my mind and set it to two? Okay, wait, let's just let's see. Set home, home two. Yeah, okay, good. That's, that's how I wanted it set up. I think the default is 10. Ooh, look at this. Node C down here. Oh, um, you know what? I'm gonna, in Discord, let them know. To put a lock on that before I forget. Before I forget to tell him. Uh, messages. Don't forget to put a lock on your mini. I think it needs to be a key lock. I could be wrong on that, though. Yeah, I've been on servers with that before, and I think it has to be a key lock. I, 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 hmm. Maybe you can just put a normal one. Oh, uh, sorry, code. Sorry, code lock. All right. to go around to this. Or th right up the middle, I guess. Yeah. Oh, our first year. Um, he's, okay, he's asking if they're still unbreakable. Should be. Let me know if it takes damage. I mean, that's, it, it was working that way <clears throat> in our testing half a wipe. <clears throat> yeah, so basically I, uh, I got the server two weeks before wipe. Or maybe it was like two and change. I figured that would give me enough time to get all the plugins and everything in order. And yeah, plugins did a lot of testing. Everything seemed to be in order. I know, uh sort of famously when Face Punch releases a uh, update as they do on the first Thursday of every month, an update of some sort it quite often can break plugins uh, which has happened <laughs> It's 
definitely a learning experience, that much I will say. Okay, so maybe I can pepper these wolves from up here. Here, wolfy wolfy. Or I can get on the roof. It's interesting, I'm not seeing any. Maybe I make a break for it. I'll make a break for it. I don't think they can get inside. Haha! -ha. Uh, ooh! That's nice. Hello? Wolves? Ooh, okay. Let's take that. Anybody home? I can hear them. Yeah, I don't think they come inside, though. That's what I'm telling myself. Maybe I can't hear them. Hm. Interesting. Imagine doing this with a gun, how much easier that would be. I mean, I'm doing alright, though. Who wants a piece? That's what I thought. Oh, did that guy just come from its out? <laughs> doing a Steve Martin impression. <laughs> Triple Steve Martin impression. Alright, there might be one more. I'm not hearing any. Alright, see, now look at all these kitties I got here. Get some of my arrows back. Get my skinning up. Oh yeah, might be needing that. If I decide to do the uh, um, what's the word? What's the word I'm looking for? Like the um, water base, like with the foundations in the water, sort of thing. Which I'm, I'm not ruling out, but also. Uh, one of the plans I had involved having a uh, a tugboat, but like a base that I could drive it like through. I thought that would be interesting. Actually, I might pick up those shutters. Do I want shutters? Uh, not yet. Uh, okay, so. What do I want to keep here? Green card. Green boom. Yeah. Okay, okay. That's good for now. They didn't even touch my backpack, which is nice. Or had to. Um, Alright, so where am I going? Red. Um, okay, I can run this road. Maybe do satellite dish and yeah. Oh, I got a green card. That way, when I get to outpost, I'll have some scrap. Um, is somebody just using this? 
Yeah. Oh, nice. Yes. In case this one breaks. There's a weird skin on that one. <laughs> Is that the egg boonie hat? I think it was. Oh, well, there you go. Take one of those. I don't think, though, that that's affected by my bonuses. This is the only issue. We'll test. We'll test at some point. Today, maybe. TBD. I don't know if I have infinite time today. But some things I have to do. Oh, just plain charts. So I guess sometimes you get things without skin. Or the default skin, really. I can at the very least afford like a horse when I get there. And I think it's a, uh, well, it'll be a deployable horse. And I think I can actually pick it up as well. Oh, good. Nice to see some cars. Oh, yeah. One of the plugins I'm thinking of um, turns bus stations into portals. So you like, you know, I guess go like, I don't know if you sit in it or you just go into it and then you can choose another bus station on the map to portal to. That's a pretty cool idea. Oh. Something they would stack. I don't know what the rules for what stacks versus what doesn't. <laughs> Excuse. Oh, you know what I should be doing? Why not? A, B, C. Always be crafting. Right? I got enough, yeah. I got enough cloth to be doing so. <laughs> Look at that fit, man. Ooh. Looking good. Feeling good. seen any sign uh well i have in the distance i was gonna say i haven't seen any scientists yet oh um oh this is gone too it's supposed to have existing come in interesting um okay so so, yeah, it seems like a lot of plugins are broken. Speaking of broken, yeah, that's crazy. Nice. Hmm. Okay, maybe once I get to Outpost, I'll see if I can fix that. Damn, I, I don't remember what it was called, though. It's almost like you should just uninstall and reinstall all plugins. That's like your best bet. Well, I'm learning. I hear I hear a 
thing. <laughs> I've done pretty good without <clears throat> mentioning this thing that I always mention, but I'm going to mention it now. It's that I normally don't play... Yeah. I normally don't play with uh, earbuds in. I'm just doing like speakers. So you don't uh, hear things, <laughs> basically. Uh, so it's always weird when I record something. Because when I record, I kind of have to use earbuds, or else you might get echo and stuff. Um, but how much like crisper the audio is. How much better the game sounds. But normally when I'm playing, I've got like... You know, YouTube on one screen, Rust on the other. That sort of thing. Uh, should I go there? I, mean, I guess I'm headed there. How are we doing for scrap? Oh, might be able to afford that many after all. gonna be a little bit of a shame that it's gonna put me behind oh man uh, pumpkins no 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 what don't I need here not oh wait I have a backpack <laughs> All right. Uh, clothes, clothes, weapons. Um, okay, what do I really not want to lose? Don't want to lose chainsaw. I think I'm going to be keeping that. Um, maybe keep that. That. Um. Um, don't really need that. Let's do a bit of organization. As you need to do from time to time. Okay. Yeah. Better. I'd love like a mace. Or a sword. So I don't have to two hit barrels. If there's anything I hate, it's two hitting barrels. Give me a one hit. I'm all over it. Hello? Oh. Weird. Like lost it. Oh. I have a feeling I'm going to be out at night time. <laughs> Since the sun's setting pretty good. Which, uh... I don't want to say it's bad necessarily, but zombies should be on now. Which is bad. I'd actually feel better if I was at a monument like this. I could see him coming. Uh, we might have to deal with wolves, though. Where are my arrows to? Alright. Yeah. Top me off, right? Alright. Wolves. Nice. 
I haven't seen a single horse. It's disappointing. I mean, eventually, once people buy them, I guess, and deploy them, it'll be less of a necessity. But there should be like a few, right? Come on. Wolves. I hear them. I hear wolves. But I don't see wolves. If you see wolves, say wolves, as the old saying goes. Should get a blue card while I'm here. I think they might have trouble getting up to these. Up the, like, the steep edges of these. Where the hell are they? <laughs> Alright, well, I shouldn't complain. There is a, like, oh, okay, but that's good that that went into there. My only question, though, is there should be a button. So the functionality is working, but the button is not, does not exist. Huh. So basically, there should be a button here that says, like, existing, all, none. I think those are the three options. So if it's set to none, nothing automatically goes in your backpack. It sets to, if it's set to all, everything goes, goes in your backpack. And if it's set to existing, which is how I had it set. Um, no. Then... Uh, it will stack with existing stuff, which is which is helpful. All right, well, there's a wolf. I don't think they can get up here though. Yeah, you can hear them kind of running around down there, but yeah, take that paddle in case this breaks. If I'm going to run the key card, which I guess I am going to. I am going to have to get down there. Yeah, I don't think I can climb up this, can it? Should have hit. That should have missed. That was way too far. But still, yeah, but still. Let me in, let me in. Let me in, little pig. Alright. Yeah, I guess even I have trouble getting up those, like walking. So it makes sense that they would. Oh, uh, what about down here, though? Screw it. Make a break for it. Hey! Oh, let me in. Okay. Wow, is that really my first pipe? Search that at some point. Hmm. This feels like a trick. Alright, alright. Hmm. 
Okay, I guess I should save my... Yeah, I'm gonna switch to this. Not ideal. Also, I'm tempted to get out of here before it's fully dark. Just make a break for it. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Before I gotta deal with all the wolves. Uh, actually, before I do that, I do want a bag in this area. It's like pretty, not central necessarily, but it's... some point any second now. Here we go. Right about here. That's fine. It'd be nice to get at least out of the woods. I wouldn't mind that before nightfall. There we go. Something about the safety of being able to see the zombies come at you. <coughs> Excuse me. Beautiful. So cool. Nice. All right. Where are the zombies at now? I think that coincides with zombie spawning. Put my light on. We'll feel, we'll feel safer with a light on, right? Uh, I'm tempted to check the console. Okay, wait. Let me get up on a rock. Because I could tell uh, in the console that they've spawned because a bunch of them will get killed by scientists, like, right away. Oh no, one was killed. Killed by Sentry Bandit. Yeah, another. Oh, I, I just heard one. I think I heard one. Hello, zombies. Oh god. They don't throw bean cans. That's what. You gotta tell yourself <laughs> to be less scared. God damn it. I could have sworn I heard one like swing in there. Alright, I'm making a break for it. The sentries will get him if he's. Yeah. Ah, see? See, see? See, si, senor? The only thing I gotta... Okay, I'm gonna say something. The only thing I gotta worry about is... Um... Okay, where do I wanna put my bag? Like here-ish. The only thing I gotta worry about is... Uh, firing at them. Because then the sentries will target me. And I don't need that kind of headache in my life. Yeah, 
this might be kind of nice near the train tracks but still bandity yeah okay oh <laughs> that's weird right <laughs> that is bizarre uh, see it's stuff like that in rest too that and I, I know I've said this before, like, uh, despite my, you know, 2,000, uh, no, I think I'm like 2,000 and change, 2,000 hours in the game, I still think, still see things that I've never seen before, or have, like, weird stuff like that happen, like, despite how large this map is, despite the fact there's, there's literally two of us on it, coming across, I mean, I know it's outside of Outpost, and people put bags outside of Outpost, but it's still kind of weird. Ooh, I think I might be able to afford once I recycle. Once I recycle everything. Afford a uh, thing I'm a bobber. A thing I'm a bobber. Uh, do I have no? Basically recycling everything. Um, maybe I start keeping. I've got a fair amount of cloth. Uh, maybe less. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So I can't afford. It's it's seven fifty. Um, you know what? Let's make one of those before I forget. Let's stop and play the piano. Block by clothing, block by clothing. How dare you? Let's grab a heli, uh, which I believe is in here. Yeah. Okay, uh, what is the... 5,000. I mean, I set the prices, so I don't know why I'm... <laughs> I don't really know why I put the Super Seer in here. I just thought it was interesting and set it for such a huge amount. Uh, this just like a dumb little quality of life thing, so pretty cheap. I figured that gunpowder, if you are going to be doing the purge and raiding, you know, you're going to want to probably save it and build boom and stuff but if you're not this gives you an opportunity to still you know do something with your gunpowder which is sell it and then you know buy other stuff but yeah this is how this is set up so this lets you uh this is how you create a shop and then in here stock level refills amount yeah kind of cool right uh i turned off drone i suppose i could have left it on for this shop but I can't really leave it on for this shop because you can't tell when anything is unless you come here. Uh, should I buy a boat? Should I buy a horse? Horse might be smart, actually. I think I am going to buy a horse. Yeah. Which I also think I can put a lock on. Okay, so let's do things. Let's get out to my bag. The general vicinity of bag. And I should be able to... Well, uh, I'll test the horse when I'm at home, just in case it doesn't work. But I think I should be able to pick, pick these up. realize I'm going to have to fly at night. <laughs> at least I got my headgear. Oh, come on now. Okay, there you go. Beep. There you go. In case my buddy wants to use it. Uh, 
um, fuel. Fuel, I'm good. Uh, actually, we just have 75 for that. Put my light on. Um, turn that off. Purple? Maybe we swing by purple and I'll put down one there too. <laughs> Not the worst idea. Airdrop inbound. Maybe we'll see that en route. That would be nice. Alright, let's try not to die. I, I have mentioned that my flying skills are, you know, 100 times better than they used to be, but they're still not great. <laughs> Okay, so another thing I should test is there shouldn't be decay and there shouldn't be vehicle damage. Whether that is working or not. Uh, let me build a hammer. Because that's how you pick up stuff. That's how you pick up your um, helicopters and various vehicles. You hit them with a hammer five times. Which is sort of an interesting... What if you have to repair? I wonder. Does a repair ever take more than five hits? I mean, in our case... Ooh, the sun's rising. That's, that's nice. Oh, let's get this airdrop, too. we do see it. Alright, where should I land? Hmm. Here's actually probably pretty good. Was that just a smooth landing, or did they not take damage? Oh, I'm still too close. Okay. Oh, no, it's the road. Or both. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey. Uh-oh. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm far enough away that it doesn't see me. That's my timer at. Oh, God, can I get to my... Am I going to be in trouble here? Don't forget where I parked either. God damn it. <laughs> Alright. Let's get some barrels while we wait. I mean, why does Bandit Camp care if I kill the pig? I didn't even kill the pig. I just scared it off. I feel like it should be like, alright, alright, you're fine. Jerks. Ooh, look at that one. It's like ice or something. <laughs> Gingerbread. Ginger Baird. Alright, I think I'm good. Is the time we're done? Yeah. Oh my god, is it back? Yeah, get out of here. Um, okay, so were I to... Interesting. It seems like it's going to work. Uh, maybe I will wait until I get home. Before I fully test. Oh. Okay. But before we do that. Oh, we're going to have a gun now. Yay. Uh, yeah, I can lay in there. All right. 
It's an airfield after all. Of course I can land there. I should try to do a bit of a harder landing. Uh, maybe I put a bag by airfields. Not the worst idea. Uh, nice thing too is I set the... Uh, well, I guess further testing. Uh, I did set the crate timers to one minute instead of 15 minutes. Even one minute, like, I debated having them just pop open, but I figured maybe a little buffer might make sense. But it's more for, like, a PvP server where people are going to show up and contest it. Whereas here, if anything, you want the opposite. You want someone coming and first come, first serve. Whereas you could, like, start the countdown, right? doing a rough landing. Hey, look at that. Okay, let me just state for the record. Purposeful rough, rough landing, okay? You saw my first one. It wasn't rough. Oh. <laughs> I may have done 69 seconds for the countdown. Um, okay, so we're going to have too much. Let's do that for now. And we'll have some organization to do. Wolves. One thing I wish it had was a map marker for where you parked. Or just the ability to potentially turn on a map marker. Also, I wonder if... Horses... Um, If uh, horses have quote unquote decay, like do you still need to feed them or they'll die? Or are you good? Hmm. Egg vision. Huh. <sighs> Okay, interesting. Um, I kind of wouldn't have minded a better gun, but I guess I'll take that. Bolty. Yeah. <laughs> not, not exactly what I'm after. I mean, a Bolty, if I ever want to run giant excavator, is very helpful. See if I can land this at home. You ever see, uh, there's, there's definitely some good, you know, Rust YouTubers who are really good at flying. It's, it's always very impressive. Like, uh, Blazed is good at getting, you know, he, he gets low and he, he's not necessarily doing tricks or anything, but I do find his flying impressive. But then there's the guys who are, like, flying upside down and doing, like, walk the dog and doing, like, crazy tricks and stuff. Where is it? Oh. <laughs> Where do I live? Alright. Maybe would have liked a slightly larger. But I feel like I can land on that. Hmm. It does have the potential of going wrong. I should put some lights on here at some point, too. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Like a glove. Huh? 
Uh, I'm going to leave that in there. I don't think anyone will be able to, with the lock on, be able to steal from it. And then I think for the horse... Where did I put that horse? Here, where do I want the horse? Down below? Oh, that would probably be in the... Uh, in the girl in the garage. The unfinished garage. Okay, so let's see. Hello. Oh sorry to me. Oh my god, it's ooh, uh, is that a uh Black Thoroughbred. La -de da I shall call you Black Beauty, because that is the name of a uh, horse who is black in color and you're beautiful uh, if you need anything just let me know I'm going to leave you down here for now though alright oh right okay what's our next what's our next step I'm yeah, probably keeping these going doing it, we're doing it. Um, oh, uh, storage. That should be our next. Maybe some research. Uh, I think I might stop wearing that. It's all well and good, but you know. storage is needed. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, here's the box sorting. Which, uh, I don't know, it, this is more for others, I guess. Uh, I'll show you how it works. Basically, you, uh, I, I don't think it's going to work on this. No, but it adds a, a category and a skin to the, to the normal boxes. Um, okay, so let's get a shelf. Yeah, maybe I need more than one shelf. I think I have to... I don't think that's a default. It's not. Okay, so maybe I research. Okay, on that note... Uh, uh, uh. Research. Level 2. Workbench. Uh-huh, uh-huh. All good things. So, a couple boxes there. Where do I want research? Research? No. Well, it might be nice there. Yeah, 
We can research while enjoying the view. The outdoor view. And then I'll put my uh, recycler box underneath it, perhaps. I could put a little uh, weapon holder there. Yeah, that's kind of nice. Oh. Level 2, since we're here. Now, it doesn't 100 make sense that you'd have your workbenches facing this way, but I assume I just slide them out, and then I use that one to work, and then I slide them out. Um, what might be cool here is that there, but i got to put a box back there first. Um, yeah, maybe I... Maybe I, maybe I do what? Research the shelves. And a bullet. And a bullet. Progress. Never a bad idea to get the ammo when you can. Okay, I definitely think metal is going to be a bit of an issue. At least at first here. Okay, well, we're going to need more wood. Okay, so, boxes. I do have good box skins, I will admit. So what would I want? Like, maybe components. Yeah. And then up top, that. Uh, you know what, I should be doing this here. Um, so what do I have? Some guns, let's do ammo. Guns and ammo. Then armor. Did I already do armor? I didn't. Guns, ammo, armor, opponents. Car. We'll put that down with the car stuff. Um... Cool. Well, here's the thing. Since my stacks are so big, medical tool, I don't think I'm going to need all of the... Okay, I use that for sort of odds and ends. I know it says electrical, but I... So maybe I just have wood, and inside the wood is all resources. Yeah, I, I think that's maybe a good idea. You know what I wouldn't mind? Wouldn't mind. <laughs> okay, maybe resources will, will do a barrel. It's a barrel of laughs. Oh, uh, we'll use the barrel beside uh, TC. That'll be resources. Your stone, your stuff like that. Okay, so, first things first, this one goes under here. I should be making key locks for all this, too. So this is, you know, things to recycle. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Do I have enough metal for nine? key lock everything, but the thing about a PvE server is yes, sometimes your bases are easier to get into um, 
But then they can't open things, so it doesn't really matter too much. Uh, okay, so odds and ends, I think, here. Which you can access through the stairs, which is interesting. Um, this, what I'd like to try to do, I don't know if I can, though. No, I don't think I can. I think I can, I think I can. Can I still put a box there? Oh, let's put barbecue. Oh yeah, maybe here. Maybe here. Yeah, and then I'll have the, the little holder. There, might be nice. Oh, can I move that back? Does it make sense that it's facing this way? No. But does it fit better? Yes. And my little burnt box underneath. Probably fridge there. Cool, 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 cool. cool. Alright. We're doing it, we're doing it. Okay, so for these, will this go right against the wall or is that... Now the train is sort of... Oh, wait. Mm. Yeah. Barrel there. I don't know why I made so many of these. Could you put one here? What would that get you? If, if you could put one here. you can't. Yeah, I don't know why I made four of these. <laughs> um, that's sort of interesting, actually. Leave the bottom open for when you got to get next to a workbench. Maybe if I'm doing any sort of auto crafting, it could be done in boxes on this top shelf. Yeah, I kind of like that, actually. Um, we do need a... Wait, I forget. A free stuff. Oh, I don't think I can do a free stuff. Because... Oh, okay, well, that was kind of dumb. Because even if I put down a box with no lock on it, I don't think people can get into it. Okay, well, that's too bad. It's too bad. Back in a second.
Okay. Now, uh, I will have edited that out, so you're welcome, I guess. Um, yeah, maybe up here. For, like, seeds and such. Okay. And if I end up not using some of these, you know, not the end of the world. Oh, uh, let me make sure. Okay, good, good, good. Just double checking sound there. Um, okay, I think we're good. To start putting down um, this. Although I wouldn't mind getting all these done. That one's done. Uh, getting these to metal. Red. I like the red, the red on red, red on red action. Yeah, makes it pop a little. Pop it, drop it, lock it. Um, all right, let's do boxes next. So, oh yeah, so that one I wasn't going to need necessarily so we'll put it in there yeah um so what do I want what do I want components that's the most important one So probably there. Well, oh, I might be able to put two boxes up there. That's kind of cool. And then here to access workbenches. Okay, okay, I kind of like that. Um, maybe a barrel in front of it. Well, we'll we'll, we'll play with that a bit. Uh, okay, so guns. Guns, guns. Bullets, bullets, bullets. Sorry, ammo, ammo, ammo. Guns and ammo. Isn't that a magazine? Guns and ammo. Cars going down there. Um, this would be my next... Oh, wait. I wonder if I can do two here. I can. Tools. I don't normally use shells. I usually just do the trick of, you know, having a whatever. But that would be a nice, nice change of pace. Um, it feels like it's sticking out too much. Oh. Okay, as long as I can get by. Um, do I have a car one here? It makes more sense to have the car one with the car stuff. I guess it's sort of like a room to grow. Well, maybe I have a boom one. Yeah, that might be cool. Um, explosives is one of them. That way, if I do, at some point, get raided, um, the raiders will have something to, uh, you know, What else? <laughs> alright, alright. Yeah, I like this. Maybe a turret in that corner facing this way. Maybe a turret here facing that way. Stranger things will happen. Alright, alright. Um, wouldn't mind one little box on that. If I can. Yeah, I'll just throw one little box there, right? 
Cool, 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 cool. We're doing it, we're doing it, I swear to God. Um, oh yeah, so. I don't know, I guess it's just sort of these ones. Uh, you know what, I should take this off. Block. So, my, so Clark can grab it. Um, mm-hmm. lock on that. He doesn't need to get into my loot. Right? Mm. Just thinking it might be cool. Let's have this here. This here. And I can like hang stuff from it. Since this is bedroom, which I'm gonna need a bed at some point. Alright. Yes, yes. These don't lock, do they? No. Okay, I think we are relatively good to grow. They can have my clothes and tools and meds. Um, all right, so with that done, let's clear this out. Oh, um, so fireplace here, right? Yeah, yeah, that'll look cool. If I can. Hmm, is that sticking out far? Sometimes these long things are harder to... Like, is that not against the wall? Hmm. Eh, I can always pick it up again if I get this wrong. It seems like it's farther out than normal, doesn't it? Yeah, that's definitely wonky. Oh. Did I get that back? No, I don't. Okay, well. <laughs> never mind. Gingerbread. It's <laughs> a little paw. It's a little paw sticking out. Oh, I should get some there. I'd like to try to do the uh, your classic um, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Hmm. Chuck. My train of thought is derailed. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Should have one of these. My bedroom. <laughs> Maybe a little hat on. Uh, 
I've got things that I can reskin. Now let's put a bag somewhere in here. Just for the time being. Yeah, like here. Home. Oh. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, let me grab all the reskinable stuff. Bang, bang, bang. That is it. Card, 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 card. Um, cards I keep. And recycling with those. Lovely. Oh, I hear the miss is coming. Yes. Okay, so let's make one of those little, what they called this. We'll put it right here. Yeah, yeah. This doesn't mount, does it? No. Or maybe I'll put it here. Well, let's see. No. I think there's good. And then I could put this sword in it. Cool. Um, okay, we'll put that away. Oh, well. Why don't I just grab everything? Or as much as I can. Um, okay, wait, wait, wait. Hmm, that's sort of like a sneaky spot. Yeah, I've never seen that before. Under the stairs. Interesting, interesting. Oh, yeah. for the missus to go. Jesus. Jeez, I'll lose this. Um, okay, that's it for components. Guns. I mean, not exactly a gun, but ammo. That's what we started with. Ammo and, no, you know what? Components. And I'll do a little little box there. Yeah, these are gun components. I like that. Um, oh, that's a sword, too? Oh, okay. I didn't even realize. I thought it was a... Uh... Oh, yeah. Let's see if we can get a sword collection. That's fun. It's fun and funny. Uh, Alright. Guns. I got a bow and a bolty. Jesus. I think all my stacks for these should be big. Oh. Hmm. 
sort of kneel down on these ones. Like it says I can open it. Oh, wait. But I can't. <laughs> Never mind. Alright. One of those. I should put that in the TC down below. 90,000 is the stack. Okay. So what am I low on? Um, two, four. I think it's metal. Or is it wood? Hmm. I'm almost tempted to... Because that feels like it's going fast. Okay, you know what? I think I am going to... Do that... Decay one. I'm going to turn it on and off again. So it's... No... No decay. And cross your fingers. So uninstall, install. Loaded. And it's still chugging along pretty good. I really think that's half decay. Uh, I'm gonna have to look at that. Because that doesn't seem... That doesn't seem good to me. Okay, so no decay. Let me open this up. Let me go to files. Let me go to oxide config. No decay. Okay, if there's no owner, it put to server console. I don't know what that means. Covered settings. Require to cover, yes. Any off on T false covered range 40. Block, block, block. Okay, and 0.5, right? Is half. <laughs> I would assume 0.5 is half. Okay, yeah, default is zero. So if I set that to zero, I'm tempted to set it to zero and see if it goes down. Yeah. Okay, so let's do that. I'm gonna I'm gonna actually set these to zero. Zero point zero. I'm going to save it. I'm going to go to the console. I'm going to reload it. Unload, reload. That, that process happens really fast, the unloading and reloading. Okay, it's still going down. So something is not right. In fact, rotten in the state of Denmark. So why would that be the case? Hmm. False, 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 false. Permission, no decay. Do I not have permission? I thought I gave everyone permission. Okay, let's see. Where's the permission? Group default. Alright, this should. No decay use. Hmm. That doesn't seem right. It just doesn't seem right. That's going down so quick. I don't know if I'm crazy, though. Don't answer that. Was it just the metal was not enough? 
Yeah, maybe I gotta focus on metal. Yeah, but now I've like turned K totally off, so why is it going down at all? Is it no, that doesn't make sense. Why would the timer be going down if the if these aren't going no it is going down. What the hell man? I don't like it. No, sir. I don't. Okay, so let's look at what the defaults are versus what mine are in terms of settings. So this is sort of what I'm talking about in terms of having to code, having to know code. Uh, config. No decay. Okay, so that's false, 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 false. No decay use. False. Log to file. Log file name. Okay, default is false. So I don't know why mine is true. I'll just make it false. Covered settings. False, true, false. Block, block, block. Um, twig one. Other multipliers. Use permission. I think there's an extra line here. Why don't I just copy this whole thing? Yeah, I'm gonna copy the general. Select all, paste. Oh, that didn't do it. Definitely don't save that. <laughs> oh, there's a copy button. Okay, save. Console. What? Man versus wolf. Oh. Note okay. Okay. It's, oh, okay. He saw a zombie. Hmm. I mean, not the end of the world if it's uh, broken or not working properly just because uh, like you're able to gather so much but that just seems like it's too fast maybe it's the seconds weren't there before and that's what's throwing me Powder. Then we can make some more bullets. And then what do we need? We need wood and we need uh Well we need lots of things to be fair. It's kinda nice that everything's just taking up one stack. Well not everything. Yeah, see this is going down. And I feel like that's a fair chunk. I guess that it is a lot of upkeep, but... One metal is one... It seems to be one metal is one minute. Not sure how that translates. Seems normal. Yeah. Hmm. 
Why no worky? No decay use. Okay, let's just see. Permission. Oh! Is that me? Did I have 21 bullets? I don't know if that was me or not. Somebody outside? Hmm. Here I am trying to do, uh... <sighs> okay, so... Um, where's that command again? No decay use. Yeah, group defaults. Alright, so what about giving specifically me no decay die use okay so I've been granted the permission no decay use would it okay here's a thought would it potentially be let me check my other I thought I just... oh yeah. Yeah, did I hear a gunshot? Did I have 21 bullets? Oh, wait, I got bullets on the cartridge. Idiot. Okay, so, what is this thing saying? Five days. Hmm. Do we think that's right? Maybe there's another option. Another plug-in option. I can't imagine it has anything to do with putting it down already. Um, so if I look in the plugins, I look at the K. No decay is which I'm using. Cupboard, no decay. Okay, so what is cupboard, no decay? There's custom decay. Use cupboard to protect from decay with resources and prevent decay under radius. permission to protect building blocks from typical damage decay damage decay damage decay radius metal Alright, well I guess I could try it. I am a little worried about having two installed at once. Uh -huh, compiles. Alright. The hell man. The only thing I'm tempted to do is like put another TC down somewhere, right? Let's see if it's that. Okay, so let's do that, I guess. Um, so let me make a TC. Oh, the new one. Alright, I'll make a new TC. And maybe I'll go down here. And I'll remove that existing one and put this one down. And see if that does it. So, remove. Yeah, we should get this 
stuff on it. Alright, so let's see. Nope. Huh. Oh, where's the patrol? Okay, okay. I want to test it. This is a good, good spot to test it too. So I got a gun out. I'm wearing all sorts of armor. Hello, it's me. It's me, Pickles McGee. Or is it leaving? It's leaving. I don't think it is. It usually goes faster when it's leaving. Cool. Like it sh now, if I shot it, it should. I don't really want to shoot it with this gun, though. <laughs> So I feel like normally this would have attacked me by now. Okay, so that's working. Oh, I don't think I posted that anywhere. Yeah. I don't think I put... Because that was like the last thing I did. There's, there's like two or three things I haven't put on the info yet. Alright, so, now that we got a gun, I guess what I should do is go out... Yeah, uh, that's something I'll sort of have to test. It, it was a combination of two things to determine how, you know, quote-unquote, aggressive it is. It was how many items of clothing you're wearing, and... Um, okay, yeah, so it's right behind. Oh yeah, we're not on a team. Oh wait, is this him? Fill that up. Okay. Fill up water. Step one. There you go. Make some bullets. Step two. Get wood and metal. away. Fifty, which I think makes a hundred bullets. That's a nice chunk of bullets. Um I can actually just do that. Bullets all of a sudden. 
too many, you might say. Um, let's do this. I should bring some cloth. Get some of that. Okay. I guess um, salvaged pickaxe would be nice. Yeah, that's good. Love. Play. Lovely. Um. Yeah, let's go on a metal run. Totally metal. All the way to here. So then, I think, yeah. This thing about that is I get there and then I just teleport back, right? There's probably a lot of metal between me, me and them. Between me and them. Um, I have a gun now. Hmm. Should get some wood though. Some of the slow, the slowness now is going to come from smelting. Maybe I should up the smelting. Oh, a horse. Of course, of course. Now, could I claim this horse? It's another black thoroughbred, which is pretty impressive. to play with those decay things, aren't I? I wish it was just like, you set it up and then you forget about it. Basically, I wish Ron Popeil was involved in some way. Dust here. Don't attack me. I got a gun out. You wouldn't attack a man with a gun, would you? Where is it? <laughs> this is making me nervous, man. Okay. Oh, wait, I think it's leaving. It's going pretty quick. I think, I could be wrong, but if it's leaving, it's not going to stop leaving, but I think it still might shoot at you normally. 
but I've, as I said, turned the aggression down a wee bit. Hmm, got no city up here, man. Nice. to get electric smelting up and going on too. That'll help. Although I do need a charcoal. Especially at first. Although doesn't charcoal often be the, the, the sort of the junction where you get stuck because you don't got charcoal. We've all been there. Hmm. I'm pretty good. Man, imagine I had an Orti. I think I did up the... XP gain, if I do recall. Yeah, there's definitely some settings where I don't 100% remember what I changed. Like, I think you normally level up a little slower. Maybe it's too fast. Who's to say? Bottleneck. That's the word I was looking for regards to metal and your sulfurs and stuff like that where you got everything you need except for this one thing that takes a little long wow <laughs> no, I might not actually have to go that far I'm just thinking it might be kind of nice to get back there and uh, what I should do is start running the road I get a test generator. That would speed things up. Did the, I think I mentioned I did invite some some friends. Uh, only one of the people I invited has ever played, and they're not a big fan, <laughs> or they had sort of lost interest. So I don't know if any of them will actually join. And I always specify, you know, no reason. Don't feel any obligation whatsoever to do so. Just like you watching this, if such a person exists. Who was watching this? Um, no obligation to join, obviously, but the option is open. Is how I look at it. I feel like 30,000 is a pretty good start. Uh, and I need, more than anything, I need uh, wood to get this stuff starting to pump away. Should I bring this horse back? Yeah, we could do a test. We'll see if this. Uh, does this horse disappear? I don't feed them versus the other one and I won't lock this one maybe well, node city man node city oh I guess 
I should. Oh, you, I saw he logged off. I was gonna say. I guess I should tell him where I. Uh, where I live. <laughs> I mean, eventually I'll zoom over there when he's on and uh, team up. Although it is kind of nice, uh, me knowing where he is and he doesn't know where I am. It will make pranking easier. That's for sure. Should I wish to get my prankage on? Oh, I got a nice view from up here. What's my nearest blue card monument? By the way. Airfield. Airfield's not too far. Yeah, maybe I'll end up running that sometimes. I could take the roads, run it, and then... You don't really want to take the same road back. If you can avoid it. Hmm. Alright. Something nothing gone. Nope. Oh. Where'd my horse go? The other one's Black Beauty, what should we call this one? Shadow Fax? What was the horse from Skyrim <clears throat> that you get through the Dark Brotherhood? Shadow Mirror. Yeah, we'll call him Shadow Mirror. Uh, is this a way down? I don't think I can get down from here. There we go. Irie? Is there a way of us away? Am I maybe not going to be bringing this horse back? Alright. Unless this is a way down. No. Okay, okay, well. I just don't think it is. One uh, nice thing, at least that I'm going to try to do, I should be able to do, is get these uh, furnaces filled with metal. And then when I go for lunch and they're all just pumping away and I come back, or even better yet, get them real filled. And then when I come, come uh, tomorrow, which, am I going to play tomorrow? I was planning on playing Bioshock. But... Something about the first day or two on a new server, even though I have all month to play. The first day or two is where it's most addicting. And it's most, why am I up this early playing? Uh, which I, did I say at the beginning? Yeah, I think I did. Like, I don't record the whole thing. Cause some of it is just, you know, an hour here and an hour there. Killing time, relaxing, doing some mining, doing some organization. Uh, but what I tend to do, or have done for four times now, is record my first day, and then record my last day. <laughs> Basically. Like base tour. Base tours, I should say, because I tend to start with one base. And then realize it might be cool to have a second one over here, or do something a little different over here. What are we doing here? Yeah. It'd be nice if I could get, eventually, it's always pleasing to me, which might be <laughs> hard with these stacks, don't we? Uh, get a line of wood, a line of stone, line of metal, even a line of high qual. I think the high qual stacks are not 90k. If they are, I won't be able to do that, obviously. Okay, so 
So once I'm back, it's going to be wood. That's going to be our next need. I got the salvage pickaxe out of it. Did I in my bag? No. Wow. I found a good node spot. Oh, does that mean it's gonna park in here? I kind of want to see that. And how long does it stay? I think I read that it's like 15 minutes it stays. the first time on this server? I think it might be. This cargo showed up yet? I haven't really been paying attention. I'm in, you know, early game resource gathering mode. Not everyone does early game resource gathering modes. Like your PvP or two, you notice that? It's interesting. All the, the myriad ways that you can play this game. I thought it was like like parked in there. Is that not it? Is it gonna come around? Or is it? It's a ferry. Yeah, no, I thought it was harbor than it. Hmm. Okay, we'll see. Maybe it's maybe it's doing a Yui. Go for wood next. Um, I think I can actually throw it in there. Out in there. You go there for now. Go over there for now. Cool. Uh, let me just do this. Eight days. Okay. I'm feeling better. <laughs> feeling better. Uh, yeah, let's do wood. Oop. Yeah, kind of cool, right? I'm digging it. Um, let's go this way for wood. Although I think you gotta beware of bears this way. Hmm. I wonder if I should have brought my chainsaw. No, it doesn't raise your levels. We're still early days. Two trees. Just 
going to be how many for two trees? It's going to be a, a pretty 5,000 for two trees. Hey, come on now. Who do you think you're dealing with here? I'm a lumberjack. And you know what? I'm okay. when the bears attack when you say I thought I heard something. I tell you those bears like a river. Screenshots of an old TC to see if it had the second hand. Did it? I, again, no, 2,000 plus hours. You'd think I would notice something like this. Three hundred percent wood. fields. I'm going to get that crate. I'm going to hope for a better gun. I'm going to get these things a pumping. And, uh, you know, rinse and repeat, basically. Should have low grade in it. I got some on my hat as well. Eh. I like that. Oh, that I don't like. I was just thinking I, I like a little jankiness coming in and out of your door because it means when people try to raid you, they're gonna have a tougher time with it. Um, okay, so yeah, let's go get this crate. I'm a good flyer. Totally meant to do that. Nothing to see here. <laughs> Alright. That could have gone poorly. Needless to say. Oh, pull up. I don't think I would die. Because I think as long as I stay in the 
the craft. I don't think I would take damage. I could be wrong. Smooth as silk. One sixty nine seconds. Uh, I suppose I could like run these. I didn't bring cards. Where's my wolf set? I saw you. I saw you there. Eh. Is that running? I'm not a huge fan of this gun. Alright. Yeah, these sights are... They leave a little to be desired. Get out of here, wolves. One left. Should be relatively wolf safe. Sometimes they're in here though. Also, didn't I say something about having ten wolves here? I think maybe I did put too many wolves. We good? Alright. I hear them. I'm hearing wolves, but I'm not seeing wolves, which frankly, it's horrifying. Yeah, there's like one over here. Here, wolfie, wolfie. Yeah. I see you. It's too many. It's, <laughs> it's just too many wolves. <laughs> oh, I should be skinning these. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, okay. Yeah, this, this has diesel. <coughs> oh, yeah, there's another... Uh, Diesel spawn in the uh, building over there. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm getting thirsty and hungry. Come on. Are these the same wolves and they're just coming back? I'm getting hungry and thirsty. <coughs> Losing voice. Let's go get the crate, which should be open. Then I'll go recycle, and there should be one or two more drums. Diesel drums. C4, good weapon. Thompson. With a weird skin on it. Alright. <clears throat> Don't mind that. Test the coil for some reason. I think I don't, like, what is it? Well, you know, I'm not the first to say it, but test the coil. Um, taking as much power as it does. I'm just going to go default skin. This is armored. Oh, nice. Okay, we've got a new front door. Um, chest piece. 
Probably. Uh, I think that's it. Or that. Recycle. Nine tech trash. One of these. Put that on my bolty. Don't need that. Cool. Not too shabby. I uh, don't need that. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. A worthwhile trip, I will say. Six diesel, not too, not too bad. Probably at some point I will run... Uh, isn't there a diesel in here? Or is a box in here? See, no one's opened these doors yet. Weird. Then says I. Um, yeah. <laughs> I never really, like, explored this. I just sort of run the puzzle and that's it. Okay. Oops, there's some crates. Let's go home. The time's it. Yeah, getting near that time where I should call it and eat and drink. Although, wait. I really want a salvage pickaxe. Oh, no. Hold on, hold on. I can get them here, I'm pretty sure. No? Uh... Does no one sell one? Well, you know what? I can research, but I also don't think I have enough to make one. Because I haven't really been saving components. Alright, alright. Let's go home anyway. Used, this is actually going to be my first wipe where I'm taking like advantage, full advantage of a mini. I've done a lot of car wipes, I just have never felt, A, never really felt that comfortable with them, uh, B, they explode and decay, so I've removed that. C, um, I have used a fair amount. Well, not a fair amount, but on that one server, I, uh... That's the word I'm looking for. Jetpack. Which jetpack... <clears throat> as you can probably do the math, it's a lot better <laughs> than a mini. Easier to control. Portable. Although, I guess this is technically portable, as long as I can pick it up. Oh my god. Oh. Alright. Perfect parking job. I wanted to come in the front door, so that worked out. Terrific. Just what I wanted to do. Um, ding, 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 ding. Ding. Um, should I put that somewhere? Put it right there. Do I set it off? Where should I put it? I put it like here. If someone's waiting for me, would I would recommend against it. Like that's obvious that that's there, but also it makes people think like, oh wait a second, this guy's using traps. Also, I don't think traps work. <laughs> Meaning, uh, until the purge is on, I don't think traps work. Oh, a uh, new front door. Who does?
Mm-hmm. Okay, keep out, knock me off. Uh, I'm not gonna bother keeping that. Five metal blades. Mm. It's not too hard to get metal blades. I'm almost feeling like what I want to do is get a salvaged pickaxe, and then that's where I'll call it. Um, I'm gonna. No, you know what? I'm not going to. I was gonna say I'm gonna put this on, but no. Keep things organized. Okay, so let's do that. Let's... Wait, where did my... Oh. <laughs> my foot was blocking it. Okay. Just that way I'll have good tools. And... Good tools goes a long way. Nine days. Oh, let's, uh... Ding, 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 ding. Yeah, I'll go run the road a bit. Twelve days. We're doing it, we're doing it. Um... I'll go run, ro run the road a, a little bit. And that should get me enough blades to make. That is the game plan. Oh, it's going to be getting dark too. Oh, which means I might... Okay, yeah. And then maybe we'll get a zombie. Which would be nice. I'd love a coffin. Coffins are great. It's one of the best reasons to have zombies is <laughs> the coffins. I don't know if I'm gonna need a a heater for my planting. Just because of where I'm located. I don't think it gets that cold here at night. I haven't noticed. I'll keep it though. Maybe I'll put one by my bed. Pants. Ooh, actual pants. <laughs> actual beautiful pants. How nice those are. Styling and profiling. I don't want that. Well, I do realize that I haven't come across one fucking blade here. <laughs> Normally it's like the most common thing you come across. I never checked. Did the cargo do a UE? I don't think it did. You know what I just realized? Did, did, oh. Oh, I did get it. I thought I dropped it. Do. Oh, look at this weird rug. Do uh, people call U turns other things in different places I'm, I'm not talking different languages I'm, but like where I'm from Canada, Ontario, Toronto-ish um yeah people call it a Yui but do they have other names? I mean Yui makes sense I suppose 
much as anything in this crazy topsy turvy world does. I guess we're going to harbor. Well, any boxes up there? There is a box. There's two boxes. Ooh, gears. Should start keeping gears too, actually. Freaking finally. <laughs> it's not enough, but at least I finally got one. It's like a, a comically small amount. Um, there's wolves here, right? I'm pretty sure. Oh, I don't have my green card. Oh, wait, didn't I? No, oh, that's what I meant to do, but I didn't. I meant to keep a fuse and cards in my bag. Like a smart person would do. That way, whenever I find myself at a monument, I can, you know, run whatever's there. Which, there's not really that much here if you don't have a key. Who wants a piece? Anyone? Oh, Jesus. Okay. You kind of spooked me, I'll admit. Just get in here. Eat a pumpkin. Yeah, I don't have a fuse. Really? That's too many shots. I feel like. full force. Oh. <laughs> Hello? Oh, I see you there. Come on. <laughs> that one was doing the, uh, the Tokyo Drift that wolves, all animals in Rust tend to do. Oh, okay. So how do you get over there? Oh, there's a bridge. Alright. Yeah, let's just explore this a little bit. Is there scientists over there now? Yeah, I kind of want to see, like, what the setup is like. Like, how you would get aboard if... Do it from this position. Where's the recycler now? Isn't it like... I thought I read that there was going to be scientists here now, but does that just mean when the, um, the hell? Well, I guess, yeah, what's the, oh, okay, interesting, Wangen. Wagon. Sometimes it's hard to tell what you can climb and not climb. Alright. An interesting little area. Oh, what the hell? Oh. 
There's a light in the distance. Okay, that's great. Pipes we need. Oh. This is kind of cool. Oh, do we want a tugboat? Yeah, maybe we take a tugboat. Maybe I won't have to uh, buy one. Uh, do we got wood for doors? Nope. These are not... Oh, okay. <laughs> so, three diesel, that's pretty good. Is there wolves over here? Hmm. Okay, so say the thing was parked here, like what would happen? I read I read that there was red containers that you can get into that could then get loaded on the ship. Alright, so right here, here. How do I get over there? Is that a... it is. <laughs> Why would you put a breakable... God damn. Put a breakable uh, barrel beside a non-breakable barrel like that. Why you gotta be like that? Okay, how are we doing for blades? Alright, I can make an axe. Uh, pickaxe. That is... Hmm. There's sorts of little hidey holes down here. Is there a, uh, a puzzle of some sort? Or a locked door? I have seen a military crate. Have I even seen one yet? Like, period? Is that jumpable? Oh, a couple of boats. Okay, yeah, why don't I take, uh... Oh, what's this? Huh? I'm gonna take a tugboat pack. Mm -hmm. Sneaky spots here if you get some green camel on, right? Sneaky, sneaky. Probably got enough to get me home, right? Authorize fuel forty one. Where am I? Um, That'll help. Traditionally, when you want a boat to go, a little pro tip I'll give you, start the engine. Okay, can I... <coughs> oh god, can I park this near my... <clears throat> near my home near the boat base I presume is there like lights like is that lights it's hard to tell oh you know what so which ones are lights on is this lights on or is that lights on I think 
it did get deep pretty quick, right? This thing is easy to uh, <laughs> beach. Um, if I could see my boat base, that would make this a lot easier. Okay, I want to come to the Where's the boat base? There is the boat base. Yeah, I want it to be like here-ish. Can I plow into it? Pretty nice. Should get some doors on this thing. <laughs> that I like actually. And then I go over here and I go over here. That's fun. Alright, alright. Yeah, uh, let me just grab some wood for a few doors. Wow, look at those pants. They're quite the fit going, don't I? I mean, eventually I'll have my default doodle. My default doodly. In fact, let me do the pants now. There you go. Doodle pants. Mm hmm. Uh, let me make a. One of those, but I do actually have a skin for that. Yeah, this is a crazy thing. This one, I forget where I got it. Like, a lot of them I paid for, like all these box ones. Ridiculous, I know, but for organization purposes, I feel like it's sort of a must. that one. Um, wait, I'm sort of curious what this is even. Come on, I feel like I should be able to put that there. Right here. Twitch Rivals. <laughs> okay. May surprise you, but I'm not actually a Twitch Rival. Um, okay, yeah, close, close. My old shitty pants. Yeah, we'll put those there. Uh, I feel like it is good to have one set of diving stuff, especially because I do eventually plan on... Uh, or at least I think I do. Building like an underwater little area. Um, okay, well, this way. Okay. Just so I know. I, I mean, not like I would forget necessarily, but it's it's nice to have a visual reminder of what my game plan is. Um, so this can go away. This can go away. Uh, let's do some other things. Okay, I'll tell you what. <clears throat> I think it might even be just tier one. It is. I'm going to make that. So that next time I hop on, I'll be good to go. Cool. Oh yeah, okay, so I did have that that one. You see I'm at workbench level two, so it's like the whole base is counting as my workbench. Yeah, that's another nice little quality of life thing. Um let me just make a few no point in having a uh, shotgun trap. Let's do a hundred point in having a shotgun trap that's unloaded, right? 
Uh, okay, so... Let's get my bag ready. So bag is always going to have this, this, and just a stack. So ding, ding, doom. Yeah, I, I, I sort of like always want that on me. Then for this... It's going to be this, this, and this. That I think I will put away for now. Oh, does this glow? Oh, nice. We'll take a glower. Um, yeah. I mean, you know what? No. You get that as part of a kit. I don't really need. I'll die at some point, I'm sure. Although, I'm doing pretty good. Only the one death so far. Alright, and then put that in there. Which I don't think will go off, even if you don't have turret authorization. Okay, well now let's see how we're doing here. going to do us for now. Yeah, 15 days. We're set up for next outing. What am I missing? Gloves. Uh, well, I like my leather gloves, which I don't have available yet. But, hey, bones, am I right? We got the bones. Fridge. Little, little eating area in here eating slash cooking. Oh, there's... There we go. My bear meat's done. We'll have a sword collection in here. Ideally. Um, bed. Good lookouts. That's uh, fishing village and our... whatever. Oh, shoot. I gotta put doors on that. Okay, okay. Um... Three doors... Three key locks. There you go. That's just for me. <clears throat> Ooh, crafting it. Just before I forget. So no one steals it. Yeah, so I could still put like a smaller boat in there. At some point. Um, yeah. I like it opening that way, so if, you know, someone's back there and trying to get by. <clears throat> it's not impossible to do so, but... Makes it slightly more difficult. Oh, that one I did wrong. Oh, I guess you can't do it with that one. Oh, you can do it the opposite way. Someone's at the front. There, you have a choice now. Okay, okay. This in particular I, I, I like. That I could just like hop right up here. And go to my home. Lovely. Yeah, so that'll be garage, boat, tugboat. Then I just walk up here. Maybe compound? Mm. Come in the front door. This is going to be just like a line of 
uh, which of my things, electrical furnaces, some lights hanging down. <clears throat> yeah, maybe I'll do something artsy fartsy up in this area, in this unused area. Yeah, I don't mind an artsy fartsy. Tier 3 workbench, eventually. Hopefully, I got room for it with the shelf here. Workbench, workbench. Storage, storage. Garage doors throughout. Mm hmm. Central open area. Disco floor, perhaps. Uh, large oil furnace thingy. You can. Uh, entrance. Okay, so nothing used here. What could I do here, I wonder? Here and here. No plan yet. Something, maybe. Got some space to play with. Uh, electric room. Mm-hmm. Yeah, all the wiring and electric in here. I think I did bump up the... We'll have to see if that took... <laughs> I bumped up the uh, output of a test generator to uh, like double what it normally is. Uh, okay, and then this will be just a four plot farm. Uh, water here coming in from down. Well, that, you know what? That's interesting. So I need the water from the river, right? Yeah. Yeah, coming from, I guess, there. Or I could just have it like, coming right from there. Is this some TC, though, over here? How far does my TC go? Building, building, building. Oh, pretty far. Okay. Yeah, I'm still in building proof. So I'm going to have it, like, right here. Interesting. Maybe some high walls there, if I can. Block them that, because you can break them from the underside, which is not ideal. Overall, though, day one, six hours in. Do I set this off? No. I feel like I got good bones. Good bones! And you can sort of see where I'm doing. And I feel like, like, is it at all interesting? I, I don't know. I, I always assume people are just watching in the background, which totally fine because that's how I watch things. Um, and it's even sort of designed with that in mind. Um, but I often wonder, is it interesting, this format that I've sort of stumbled upon, which is see day one, see bones of base, then there's going to be a cut, and you're going to see the, uh, the finished base, ziz, plural, and all I have complete, completed, and not necessarily everything in between, but that's because that's my month. My month of R&R, &R, rest and relaxation, and R, rust. R&R&R. &R &R. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. One to grow on. All right, folks, uh, from your uh, point of view, nothing will uh, happen other than a transition and a base tour. For me, it's going to be a month of playing on the server that I have made. Specifically, this one. Librarian Log Plays, A, PV of Purge, etc. Feel free to join. Why don't you? Um, yeah, oh, it's a, yeah, okay, I was just going to say, I went through the info and everything, right? Future plans, wipe schedule, all that fun stuff. Okay, see you momentarily. Hmm? Oh, just because it feels wrong not to do so. It's nice to be nice to the nice. Hey, we're back. Well, I mean, I'm back. You're still here, presumably. presumably. Never presume, because then you make a prez out of you and me. Mm-hmm. All right, uh, so, you know, thus commences the base tour. So this is it. Just kidding. I did decide I wanted to put a... Uh, so I went around the map and put recyclers on the fishing villages and the barns. So, if you play on the server, you have that to look forward to. I figure I'd start here since I live right there. Have a nice little walk. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, looks like it's gonna be night soon. Well, you know what, that's okay because uh, this place looks kind of cool at night. So, um, I added a plugin uh, that lets you buy trees for scrap. Mm hmm. Yeah, so basically, um, you just type. Uh, do I have scrap? I, I don't think I. Well, I got it. There's. I'll show you one. Tree, we'll just do oak A. I know it's kind of small. I put one of each. Put one of each. You have to be within uh, TC range. That's why they're all sort of clustered here. And then it puts a tree down. So, you know, you got that going for you. Um, I think I had started horse base, and I, to be honest, I didn't really do much to it. It just sort of stayed where it was, other than this box. Oh, I did get a boat eventually. And all these pipes, which we will be looking at, of course. I actually don't know who... I think my buddy put that horse there. <clears throat> That's my horse, and I think I did find that one. Um... Uh, yeah. Six shit. Alright, so let's go on up to the base proper. Oh, uh, this box sacking. I was just testing it. <laughs> and I wanted, if anyone stopped by, to be like, oh, wait, how do you do that? And then they go into the info, and they will see how. So you're going to see a lot of these. Which is pipes coming into a box, and then pipes going out of a box. Going that way, which we'll have a look at. Oh. I left the radio on, so I'm going to talk, and hopefully not get a... Oh, let's push this button. <coughs> hopefully not get a... Copyright. Alright. <laughs> I forgot I left the radio on. Yeah, so uh, this button... You know I like to do that, if you've watched any of my videos. Your classic opens and closes all doors button. Um, yeah, we had had a nice farm going up here. Got a fair... We got some teas. You know, we got a fair amount going. Poop. Lovely. Um, I don't like to turn this off. I don't think I'm going to be doing any more farming. Why did that not turn out? There you go. Uh, yeah, what were they for? One for light and one for heat. If I do recall, right? Yeah. Alright. Well, you know what? I'll leave the lights on. Uh, electrical room. Nothing fancy. I did uh, high quality some stuff. Just for poops and giggles. So, yeah, a little electrical mat in, in the high qual or in the electrical room. If that makes sense. As much as anything does. So these, um, actually have one on the TC to show you. Normally, uh, test generators put out, put out, uh, <clears throat> 300, excuse me, 300 power. Um, but I doubled it. So normally each of these is 100. But I made each of them 200, just to give it a little, uh, little boost. Because you can do things like that. Um, yeah. Uh, okay, yeah, I wasn't doing anything. Alright, alright. Um, oh. Idiot. I forgot I had that. Yeah, because we're going to do a thing. We're going to do a thing. Okay, so yeah, not too much changed. Um, one sort of cool thing is if you put... Uh, ore in here. Well, if you put anything in here, it will be distributed where it should be. So if you put ore in here, <clears throat> it will end up in these nine uh, furnaces and get smelted and then end up eventually over here. If you put anything else, I'll show you, it will go into the loot area. Uh, this was just uh, a charcoal maker since um, <clears throat> one of the things I'm, I, like, I'm almost sort of, quote-unquote, done on the server, kind of, sort of, kind of, sort of. <laughs> um, but I want to, like, sort of build up resources so that when I start next, um, 
next wipe I'll be set. Oh, that's it's getting dark out soon, from the looks out of it, which means these lights should automatically come on. Oh yeah, look at that. Um, a selection of guitars. That's fun. Oh yeah, I got distracted. So yeah, so uh, put it in that coffin. Loot will end up in here. Um, and then sort of gets distributed among all these boxes. Now these boxes on shelves because I hadn't yet uh, bought the... Uh, I actually had to pay for that chest stacking one, uh, plugin. And plugins are expensive. But, you know, that's, that's one I really wanted. Mm hmm. I, I haven't really been focusing on boom. I've been selling a lot of my, uh, a lot of my scrap. Uh, guns were looking pretty good. Good. A lot of bolties. It's because I made so many for turrets and then I made too many. That's why I got a lot of bolties. This sucks. Oh, there you go. Let's just come on. Did you know you can't use this against, uh, attack heli? Like, what's even the point? I guess maybe use it against Bradley. Um, uh, yeah. Fat stacks, because the stacks are bigger. Mm-hmm. Art, I guess. So because I have a plugin with... that randomly generates skins on things you find in the world, whenever I found a, a skin I hadn't seen, I would sort of bring it back here. Yeah, so... <laughs> this is a mess. But it works. It works. The only thing I don't like about auto uh, distributing loot like this is like it doesn't stack things properly. So uh, I guess the prime example, do I have any in here? No. Uh, normally I, I go in and stack it. So if I put pipes in that thing over there, the pipes would end up here and not in the stack, which is kind of dumb. Kind of dumb. Um, alright, I guess that's it. Uh, I did set up a auto, uh, crafter, so that's why I have way too many meds. Uh, oh yeah, okay, so, I found a few miniguns in my travels and played with those a bit, so there's one of them. Uh, this, you can sort of go up here, I got some kits, should I need them? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, I found this this skin out in the world. Sort of interesting looking. I don't know what it's from. I feel like it's from something. Yeah, got some bear skins. Your default. Okay, so this one is interesting because it goes out there. Yeah, out to that over there. So if I put something in this coffin... Actually, why don't I put something in this coffin? Then we'll see. Um... Here we go, we'll go 420 wood. Boop. Any second now, there you go, it's gonna start going down. Uh, and when we go out there, there'll be a box that has 420 wood in it now. Um, okay, so yeah, this one's sort of interesting. This is what I'm gonna bring to next white. So, um, my, my levels, you'll see in the bottom right, there's the Acquire Crafting Mining. Um, those I'm gonna wipe every wipe. So those give you bonuses to those things. Um, so that's gonna wipe, I'm gonna wipe, um, uh, blueprints every other wipe. So this next wipe I'm not going to, and then I will, and then I won't, and I will, then I won't. It's all in the schedule. Oh yeah, actually, that's something I should show you. Whoops. This took me a long time to figure out. <laughs> it was, I don't want to say that I learned coding, but uh, I'm probably, well, I'm definitely a better coder than I was when I started a REST server. Let's, let's put it that way. Uh, Discord, yeah. Uh, so, if you are watching this on my YouTube channel, from time to time, it's not impossible that you will see strange comments on videos revolving around a uh, Rust uh, a Rust server, because I decided I don't want to do a mint. This is, this is a for funsies thing. This is not a to make money. This is not 
for others thing. It's for me and for you if you think it will be fun for you. Mm-hmm. So uh, all my admin is going to be done through YouTube comments. And there you go. And then you <laughs> have the bonus. Two bonuses, really. I have my uh, YouTube comment moderation set to strict. So that will weed out some assholes, potentially. And also, um, you know, you get some uh, comments on YouTube videos. It's just good for your channel. So hey, win-win. Uh-huh. Okay, so let's look at some plugins. Admin shop. Oh, yeah, I should show you that all set up now. Mm -hmm. Z levels, I mentioned. Zombies, did we have? I guess when I was setting this up, I, I don't really remember what I had versus what I didn't have. Okay, yeah, so backpack. Two rows and is protected on death. Some notes. Uh, yeah. Okay, I guess I didn't mention here that it's protected through wipe as well. So when I start the new wipe, and I did test this last time and it did work anyways, I should have everything that's in my backpack. Uh, yeah, so scrap is 2x, slight buff to some tables, uh, resources of vanilla, but these Z levels are crazy. Like, um, the difference that these make in gathering resources is, you know, as you play, it gets it's very noticeable. Half decay, that took me a while to figure out. I had a bunch of, uh, I tried two or three plugins that just didn't seem to work. But I found a, a workaround, so we're at half decay. Uh, bigger stacks, yes, faster recycling. Mm -hmm. I think it's actually instant in Outpost and Bandit, the recycling, and then just, you know, quicker everywhere else. Creek timer, <laughs> unburnable meat, I don't know why I mention it, but hey, why not? Uh, no vehicle decay, mm -hmm. box sorting. Oh, is that working? I don't know if that's working or not. Wait. It's not working. Oh. That's the thing about these plugins. But it's interesting because it does. Yeah, see, it is working here. But that's not working. On, oh, wait. Oh, you can't do it on small boxes. Okay, so it is working. So, were I to push one of these. Well, why don't I do it on this one? Because it doesn't matter. So, say I wanted this to be a weapons box. Boop. And now it's for weapons. Say I wanted it to be closed. Let's do the closed one because I think it's kind of cool looking box. There you go. Now it's a closed box. So that way if you don't have any skins, you could still sort of remain organized a little bit, which, you know, I appreciate. Clearly, if you've watched any of my things, <laughs> that's something I appreciate. Okay, okay. Anyways, um, let's finish our info tour. Uh, quality, uh, yes, chest stacking, yep, using right click, and more probably. There is more, but I'm, you know, running out of room, and things, I want, I wanted, uh, what is it called? No fall damage, for example, I wanted that to be a surprise, so yeah, you don't take fall damage. Uh-huh, yeah, we got some, uh, oh, that doesn't belong there. Giant excavator. This should be up here. Tree planter. Uh, okay, wait. I'm going to make a note. Because maybe I'll see things. And that's something that I'm finding. Um, simple shirt. Disable. So that is giant excavator notes. Move to proper spot. Is that there's like a lot of tweaking. Like, uh, you're never just sort of setting it up and leaving it. There's a, there's a lot of, you know, change this number, change this number. And, you know, I feel like I'm slowly getting it to where I want. Uh, so, f well, this one's interesting. I, I, I got a plug-in for a foundation limit. So, it's 50, which was a lot. Like, not many people are going to have a base with 50 foundations. But the interesting thing is, it only counts if they're connected. So, like, I could do 49 and then go to another spot and do another 49 or whatever. So, I thought it was, like, 50 total, but no, it's it's 50 attached to foundation limit. True PvE, yeah, still seems to be working good on it. Random respawn, mm-hmm. Less aggressive heli, I'm digging. 
No sharks. Now this is interesting and something I was actually going to test when I'm done here. Um, there's no plugins for it that I could find. So I did things on the back ends that I found online that should work. And it seems like it should work, but then yesterday I was underwater doing some building and uh, a freaking shark attacked me. So I really got to figure that out more. Random events. Oh, yeah. That, that's a new one since last time. Okay, so there's your commands. You got your classic set home kits, although you start with a kit. Did it, had I set up the kits yet? Yeah, I had. <clears throat> Future pan, plans. Water foundation, yes. Yeah. Uh, all these are paid for ones, though. Map voting. Oh, yeah, I got a cool map chosen, but I haven't set up a way in which to vote for maps. Uh, base tours. Something I'm thinking of this is putting a... Like a note somewhere in here, or maybe it's its own separate. That if you build on the server, your um, your base may show up in a video. That sort of thing, because I just want to be able to show the cool bases that people build. Yeah. So here's the wipe schedule with purge. A beautiful day. Let's go out this way and get a view from the. Uh, eh. Get a view from the top. Oh, auto doors. Uh, not auto doors, but you can buy auto closers at the shop. Mm hmm. There you go, eh? Should I do this? Yeah, I haven't yet chosen a thumbnail. Yeah, my little, uh, little thing. Um, I've done, this is the first full wipe where my primary mode of transportation has been this. And, you know, I'm still not an expert by any means, but I've definitely got it better. Like, to the point where my buddy actually, I was flying him around, he says, whoa, wow, okay, you're good at this now. <laughs> because I was. I mean, I, I guess I should get the most improved award because I was so shit at it. Alright, my weird little grove of trees. This guy. Mm-hmm. Um, do those have... I'm pretty sure they do. I think they... I wonder what I could do with that. Yeah, it does. Or... So there's, like, things you could do with this, I guess, that could, like, trigger stuff like treat this as a switch almost which i've never really done maybe i'll i'll do something with that next next slide but i do got a cool plan for a base next way uh you'll see that in the next uh, rest video uh is that anything no you know what's hilarious about this well, well let me just say one thing i don't know much about jeans i know all greens are good i think there may be like, I don't know if these all greens are the best all greens. I kind of don't think they are. I think there's maybe better options. Um, you know what? I'm not going to show you this. This is just a little hint. A, a tentative hint at next wipe. Okay? And we're not even going to... We're not even going to look at it. Um, I'm going to be doing some flying here. Yeah, so again, these are all just this this some of them you know oh yeah i put eggs on top of them <laughs> why i don't know mm-hmm oh has our wood made it through i think it probably has mm-hmm yeah nothing too fancy I, they do get pretty deep though beware sharks actually is there a bottle somewhere in the sir I know there's a spawn somewhere around here. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And then this little one. Ah! <coughs> mm-hmm. Shotgun trap? I did put stuff in it. Yeah, okay. Cool. Let's go. 
All right, what should we check out first? Uh, I feel like this thing. This monstrosity. Mm-hmm. You know why they're doing this? Because there's too many turrets. Mm-hmm. <coughs> Where are these turrets? I don't see them. Well, here's some up here. One there. One in that corner. We've got a SAM site. We got... Oh, I forgot to... To do that we have maybe a mine or two or like 17 or whatever mm -hmm. oh what's behind these oh my god a shit ton of turrets now this should work that they could shoot out of here uh, pressure plates that aren't connected to anything but just give a sense of unease as you're walking through um, I've been having an issue. Did it do it again? For some reason, every once in a while I'll log in and some of these will be gone. Some of these roofs. And I don't really know why. Like, they have stability. Clearly I'm able to build them. But, uh, yeah. Make sure all these doors are closed. Okay. Yeah, so you can come down here. Just a crap ton of turrets. Oh, this is, um... This is where the door is. Oh. No. This is the door if you want to get into this section. However, if you want to get into the base proper, you actually got to go down and then up. Mm-hmm. And then you got this friggin' thing. This took a while to build, as you can imagine. Right? Yeah. Um, I did build this, although I'm not currently using it. Maybe I should. So this is just so you can hide loot. Although it's not that hidden. Hmm. Uh, but then you can come up into the base. Yeah. You're in trouble now. You're in trouble now. Uh, and then you can come into here. Oh my god, that's too many traps. Just an uh, insane amount of traps. Did you know you could put a minigun in a, in a turret? You can, apparently. Uh, okay, so there should be... F hey, look at that. So that's how things get out here. I don't think I have anything in these, so. Yeah. Ooh. Look at that, eh? No. Oh, I did want to show this. This I spawned in, I will admit. Um, but that's because uh, of what we're going to do next. I'll just show you the electrical. Yeah, whenever you're doing turrets, that's a lot. That, that's not even it. All these are taken. So that's 30. 30 of these houses. Okay, so now why did I spawn that in there? Because I'm going to post this video before wipe is over. And uh, I thought, uh, with that in mind, should someone see this video and actually make it to this point, um, they could potentially come and try to raid this thing. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm going to do something in a moment that will make that easier than the just coming in and grinding for everything. Um, okay, but first, let's uh, have a little move. Yeah, I thought I would just have a have a fun little spot to set. Some drums up there, I believe. And a little, you know, cozy little base inside. Just for groups of giggles. Oh, a uh, thing I added yesterday. I actually wanted to test. Uh, so, uh, lanterns, certain things, this will be a good test actually, certain entities, lanterns, hobo barrels, there's a few others, um, not furnaces, not barbecues, not refineries, but some things shouldn't require fuel, or, sorry, shouldn't consume fuel, I should say. So, this should just, like, keep burning to do this. Yeah, I feel like this would have gone out already. Okay, so that, that's working now. 
Um, so yeah, you can read this too. I, I don't really have anything in it. It's, it's just sort of, you know, it's here. Actually, you know what? I didn't even put a lock on the door, so feel free to come in if you want to do it. I put one of these tables. What are these for, anyway? I don't know. So yeah, uh, you know, some guns. Some guns for you if you want to come. Hey, that's free. Although you do have to get to here. <laughs> And that'll be slightly easier said than done. Uh, okay, so I think that's it for this. Yeah, not, not too much there. Okay, so let's go um, fly around. Let's see what we see. Um, I gotta decide where to build this little thing. So this is uh, my buddy's base. You know what, I think we'll, we'll fly by and have a look. But uh, I don't want to show the inside in case people come on and raid it, right? That wouldn't be nice. <laughs> it's nice having this ability to uh, fly around a bit like this. It's fun. We'll go right through the dome. Have you ever f flown through the dome? But you haven't. No. New. Good times. And maybe I'll show you the, the one other base. Is it still there? Well, there, there was a couple. So these are other players. Um, haven't been exactly an active server. That being said, that's fine. <laughs> that being said, that's fine. Like, that, that, that's not why I made this to uh, have a crap ton of people on and uh you know make money from having a popular server that's not really the point of this however i also haven't done any you know quote unquote advertising in terms of posting it places so yeah this is gonna take a sec he's been busy <laughs> so yeah i won't go inside but i just want to show you what that's that's a lot of gates Oh, is he double walling it? Oh my god. I think he double walled it. Okay, well, last time I swing, uh, I came over here, it hadn't been double walled. That's impressive. Double high wall. This whole island. Houses. Oh, I put these here. <laughs> Alright. Well, that's not very secure. <coughs> <laughs> All right, so this is his island. I suppose you could come raid him too if you want. Oh, uh, you know what? Uh, I'll show you the shop now that it's been set up. Uh, he, that's another base there of, of his. No, no, I won't show you that one. So you, you, you can't get any idea unless you come to the server. Um green than red. Yeah, why don't we scope out... It's a cave base, these other people. Uh, and then once we've scoped out everyone's bases and the outpost, I'm, uh, what I'm gonna do is plonk down a little uh, hidden uh, one by one somewhere, probably in the woods or something. Maybe I could do it underwater. That's kind of cool. Um, and then I'll uh, give the code here in this video. Meaning that were you to go to this server and go to where this base is going to be located, uh, you're going to have a crap ton of resources to get a good start, as it were. If that's something that appeals to you. A uh, good enough start to either have a really good start for next wipe or potentially come and try to raid. Um, I have a base around here somewhere. Oh, here it is. Yeah. Just a little one by ones. Whoa. Okay. This is where I did my first stacking and tree tests. Yeah, there's nothing in any of us. It's just a... Yeah. Nothing fancy. I just wanted to check on it for old time's sake. Okay, so let's check out the little shop area. Here it is. There you go. 
just like a little, uh, you know, listen to some tunes. Uh, I think I've shown, did I show the shops? Oh yeah, this is interesting. You gotta go into it and then out of it again for these to show up. And I think I did mention last video that, uh, you can't, I mean, you could, you'd have to like either take your chances or memorize their locations. Um, oh no, I turned off drones. Okay. Yeah, you can't come, you can't buy stuff via drone. Uh, I think this seems to be good. 1,000 for 200. Yeah, like I was raking in pretty good. Oh, I added, I did this since last time. So the nice thing about this is it opens green, blue, and red doors. So that means you can just carry around one card, which is kind of nice. Another, another dumb little quality of life thing. Um, serum. This is a cool late game, and this is actually how my buddy was able to... He did mention he bought one of these. Um, uh, like, that's how he was able to get all the resources for those, because it gives you, like, a 300% bonus. So, I, you know, I, I, you can get it in and out of this over here. That's something. This should all be here for next way. It worked the first time, where everything saved. Uh, so let's hope it saved next time. I actually did have, like, a bunch of stuff back here I built, but I think it was actually slowing the server down. Yeah. So, I removed some stuff and made it a little simpler. This area. Okay, so let's go now to scope up these people's bases. They're a cool little cave base. I scoped it out already. I actually, when I was flying, I managed to fly through here on my... Now, I did touch down and uh, maybe a slight bumpy ride, but I did manage to do it on the uh, minicopter, that is. Okay, you got your classic uh, Teen Tower. Teen Titans Tower. Yeah. Let there be light. Um, where's the bucket? Okay, yes, yeah, this, this is your classic uh, bucket. Bucket brigade. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I suppose you could come raid these people now, which is maybe not the nicest thing I've just realized. However, they haven't been on in a while. Actually, I think things are decaying. I think there was a door here. Yeah. Cool little dance floor, which I appreciate. That right there. Did I change their settings? Blue. Like that. Is this not getting... <clears throat> is this not getting power? Uh-oh. <laughs> Copyright. Alright. Cool little base. Okay, so now where should I... Where should I build this? Somewhere, like, out of the way, like, here. Yeah, let's just see if we can find a cool spot there. This is the sound you have to make when you're flying. Alright. I'm looking for a woodsy area. Ooh, a little nook like this. This is pretty nice. Yeah, like right here. Um, okay, I'm gonna have to spawn myself a bunch of stuff. Um, okay, so first, where am I? Alright. So, for you watching this video, if you watch this stuff, 
that's where it is going to be. Um, Alright, so I'm going to need resources. Um, I'm going to need a door, a plan, key locks. I'll throw a door closer on it if you want it. Um, TC. Uh, test generator, which I guess you could probably pick up actually. Free test generator. That's pretty good. Okay, um, let's build some stuff. It's just going to be a very simple. Uh, Effects. Um, Put on the roof. There you go. Oh. <laughs> It goes in the floor, so it wouldn't let me wouldn't let me upgrade it. Actually, it might be easier just to do this. The flying controls are good, but when building, <coughs> sometimes, oops, a little simpler. Cool so far. Uh, let's throw this TC down. Let's do that. Um, what was I going to do? Let's do this. Let's do these. Okay, codes. Um, Let's do simple five, 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 five. Okay, so that's gonna be the code. If you want the stuff that I'm going to put in here. Just a bunch of fives. Oh, how come I give myself two? I didn't mean two. I didn't mean two. I just found out this was possible. Done. Uh, let's throw one of these on. Let's. What else? Sure. Uh, oh, yeah, I need a box of some sort. Throw a barrel down. Bar.
Okay, so now what are you going to get if you come raid this? Um, a lot. You know what? I, I prefer... 3,000 scrap. An amount of stone. An amount of wood. An amount of high qual. I was like to just put this in the... Uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, metal. Oh, tree trimmers event. Trap trees to win. Uh, I think I have a thing on me too. Alright, I'm gonna get myself some scrap. So you'll see how this worked. Did it start? It didn't. 30 seconds. Gives you a 30 second warning. What am I hearing up here by the way? Go on, get. Go on. Get out of here. What did I say? Okay, tree. So, let's chop a tree. And then I'll get myself some scrap. Uh, yeah, so I added these events where you, you know, do stuff like this. And then you have the potential to win scrap. Whoever does it the most. Now, you can... And I actually decided against it, because I've never seen it done before, and I think it's a cool idea. Uh, normally, under that, where it says extra events on the bottom left, uh, there would be a... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, leaderboard. But I actually decided against putting a leaderboard, because I thought that way everyone will go out and do their best in the hopes that they win is the thought process whether that is accurate or not D B D E uh, E E E E E alright so there you go that's uh that's yours if you want it beware the horn oh wait can I unauthorize myself on this Damn it, I wish I didn't throw that tool. Hmm. I, I, I just want to hear what it sounds like. Or like how it works. I've never done it before. Okay, so I'm not authorized. On it. But does that mean I can... Power it still? Yeah, okay. Uh, alright, let's see what it sounds like. Hello? Oh, do I have maybe... Uh, instruments off? No. Yeah, it's this one, right? Um, it's this one. Uh, maybe I gotta... Hmm. Why is it not working? Is it because I put it down, maybe? Oh, I'm an idiot. It's because of the PV PVE. So when the PVE is off, it will, uh, it will, uh, there you go, I have a free tool as well. Uh, you know, it, it'll start shooting. That's why, uh, it doesn't, um, there you go, I'll throw a workbench in there for you. Oh, and the scrap ended up in mine. Um, there you go. 5,000 scrap, too. Uh, yeah, because these backpacks... 
Oh, damn, the button went for that as well. Things, so, like, if I were to pick up a piece of scrap, it would automatically in here. If I were to pick up 556, five, it would, like, it auto stacks, which is pretty cool. I guess that's it, yeah, it's really. Oh, why did that happen? <clears throat> yeah. I don't know why that happens. And how am I over there? I'm pretty sure I'm not over there. <laughs> That's the thing I'm over there. Okay. I assure you I am not. Um, okay, so let's go home. Home too. Which will take us home. Oh yeah, uh, since last video I did change the number of homes you could set from one to two. Um, because I like such giant maps, like, around 5,000, 5,000 plus sometimes, um, I thought that would be nice. So you could have, like, one on one side of the map, one on the other. Here's some art, um, and then why don't we end with, let's do a little flying, and we'll see if I kill myself or not. Um... Okay, I'll tell you what. Can I land on top of the white on the lighthouse? That I've never done. I, I think I tried to do it once. And you know what? Landing is still not my best. But like doing that, what I just did. I didn't used to be able to do with any degree of confidence. But now, you know. I'm flying, I'm flying pretty low. Is that guy gonna shoot at me? I don't know. It's a scarecrow. It used to take me a lot longer to land than it does now. I still don't know if I could land on top of this. That feels like it's gonna be maybe out of my capabilities. The fact that you can't see either it certainly doesn't help. Oh, what's that little base there? Oh yeah, I was just doing some playing around. Hmm. Okay, maybe can I land on the second part? I've never done that either. <laughs> can I land by this chicken? Yeah, you know what? Oh, no. Oh. Hello. This chicken is attacking me. I have never seen a chicken attack. So I feel like that's a good spot to end. What am I, friggin' Link over here? Yeah, that's a good spot to end, being chased by a mad chicken. I didn't think they even could attack, to be honest. That is insane. Hmm, okay, how should we kill this chicken? And then that's well, where we'll end it. I don't think it can even get up here. <sighs> yeah, what's the craziest thing to kill a chicken with, would you say? I mean, yeah, rocket... You know what? I've killed a chicken with a C4 before. Maybe try that with the new minigun. Um, uh, where are weapons? With a wooden stake. Grenade. I think it's coming for me. Yeah, let's do min oh, let's do flamethrower. Because then we can eat it after, right? Alright. Um, let me just say thank you for watching. Um, I hope to see you on the server. It's been, uh, you know, a fun experiment getting this set up. And, um, you know, it would be nice if people like it. If they don't, that's also okay. I'm not too worried. I like it. I like it. And I got a cool plan for uh, the next uh, Rust base. So, let me just end by saying, as I end by saying all of the various things that I do online, which is, of course, it's nice to be nice. Oh, they nice.